Hello everybody, welcome back to our second attempt at starting this game up. Yesterday was quite rough for me, there's nothing I can do about that. I had initially felt good, felt fine, and then sometimes it just doesn't stay that way. Feeling fine today, we'll see how it goes overall. Maybe today will work out better. <clears throat> Did I pick the right game? <laughs> I don't even remember this. I'm pretty sure I did. The spaceman here? Hold on. <laughs> yeah, we picked the right game. So this should be continuing as we learned last time. I just don't remember what's going on in the intro. <clears throat> and apparently there's astronauts. This explains why some of the dialogue was the way it was. I don't know what the, like, world lore is overall, but anyway. I'm gonna attempt to make some progress today. I need to move some things. Uh, I wasn't fully set up yet, but we'll get started proper in a bit. There we go. Alright, we're in some town. Right, I need the uh, translator open. To help me out. <laughs> we are in some town. We're looking for some other town. We're in Silica. We're looking for a town called Rizel for the next uh, story beat. Uh, we are surrounded by slimes. This stuff seems interconnected in ways. So I'm just gonna look around for... Possibly that over there. I believe we started from here. And we have these slime enemies. That do not provide us gold. The last time our hero had all their money stolen from them. I'm wondering if you knew in advance if you could just buy a bunch of the anything, a bunch of anything, and then sell it. I don't think we want this way. We might want this way. <clears throat> I don't want to fight the red slimes, though. Not that they're threatening or anything. Oh yeah, right, they stay in place. Hey, you can't recombine yourself together like that. That's uh, ludicrous. I swear I was holding up. Oh, damn it. <laughs> it's really hard to maneuver here. <clears throat> Alright, let's do this. There you go. We got around them. This is not the town we want. This is the Silica. Silica. <clears throat> Excuse me. Holy red slime mealy. Alright, this is a place called Masukun, Masukun. Not what we're looking for. So I'll still hit up the NPCs. But 
But this isn't the tale that we desire. <laughs> We're broke. We are how you say berserker. There's one of the king guys here. Po po po. He apparently laughs like po po po. It's best for children to be healthy. Dragon Slayer. She said to do something with Dragon Slayer in Game Boy, the only Dragon Slayer you played. Mm, not sure if uh, it's related or not. I'm not familiar with the Dragon Slayer on Game Boy. Is the Dragon Slayer on Game Boy part of the Legend of Heroes franchise? Because if yes, then yes. This is a Legend of Heroes game. Like Trails of Cold Steel and all that popular stuff. It used to not be popular. Uh, Trails series. Or the Legend of Heroes series it used to be lesser known and then it skyrocketed in popularity for some reason. You don't know Legend of Heroes. It's probably no relation then. If I had to wager a guess. What's good, Trauma Turtle? Doing better today, hopefully. We'll see how long that lasts for. I can't afford any of these things. Alright, let's leave. Let's keep looking for the town we're looking for. And there's another castle town up here. Somewhere. It's a cave. This is not what we're looking for. This is Kiri Kutsu of Trials. Shuden no Kiri. Really, Shuden. I wonder if they don't let you open chests if it's dark. I only have the one torch and then we have Wafu. Which apparently war the warp is uh... Yeah, you can hit the R button and get a world map. And go back to any t town. Your warp is infinite, supposedly. Uh, I'm also noticing if you like look on the bottom left, there's apparently a blinking red and green pixel. I'm not sure why. Sometimes they're there and sometimes they're not there. And that's the game. Remember, we are not on emulation, but console. So that's just a curious thing. All right, anyway, I won't warp now, but I can use that screen as a world map screen to look around. Okay. <clears throat> this might be where we want to go. This is a Liesel, Lieseru, Lieseru. Yo, yo. Oh, me. Ma. Da. 
Koli... Zuni? Beep, 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 Let me get this one. Any context? Okay. Let's just say that I did not really gleam what was being discussed on that last one. do and go around talk to the NPCs make sure we hit plot triggers we should gain a new ally here and I think it's the old man Raun or whoever it was from yesterday This would be a pretty sophisticated game to grasp for me. There's a lot of kanji in the speaking. Very advanced stuff. It's not all hiragana speak. Shop, shield shop, not what we desire should be. Yeah. Bokuwa. Introducing yourselves to the guards. That is a solid wall. And that is a solid wall. Shikashi. 
<clears throat> it's Unina not demo. Might be the prison cell. We are looking for the throne room. I'll be back down and talk to them. This is probably what we're looking for. It's like a very uh, expected jingle. I can predict the beats despite not hearing it for very long. This is King Yeston. Justin. Oh, we're getting someone else, not the old man. Pink, 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 pink. Hey. Important dialogues. I hand it over Canon's personal letter, but it shouldn't be Canon. Canon no Shinso Atashimashita. So that's one of the four kings done. I wonder if I can go back to the woman and let her know that we were robbed. Also, give me a second, I've been messaged. very first thing we said. Yes. We have affirmed whatever it was that this guy has asked us. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we did what we need to do here, although we need to collect the the dude who we met at the front gate. I still wanna get through NPC convos so they're captured. <clears throat> so remember one of my goals with playing these games, not only to beat them but to document them essentially. Do as much as I can. Although I don't necessarily hundred percent stuff, but
I will say NPCs move quick in this game. They are fast peeps. Ba, 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 ba. Right, back to the town. Uh, we can't leave unless we talk to this guy. This is who we're looking for. This is Rondo. We have a new comrade. Hey, what's up, Sarge? Okay, so now that he joined us, and we've been around this town, and we're still broke. We need to go to Ralph, uh, which we were at earlier. Oh wait, I could just teleport. <laughs> This is CD now. Is this Rob? Huh? I think we were at Ralph uh, earlier. This is Masukun. Where am I currently? I assume I'm on this island on the left. Masukun would be this. This would be uh Sirika. This is Ralpha. This is Rarufa. Uh, 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 uh. Convenient teleportation power. Alright, we need to talk to this lady in the ticket shop. Because we need to buy another boat ticket. And we need to realize that we can't afford it. Because our genius hero here let himself be robbed. I mean, you talk to this guy. Apparently. He's going to tell us about a spell shop. And then we got to go find a spell shop. Alright, I can't go up here. <laughs> I mean, talk to him again, but he's in the way of the door. <laughs> uh, I don't think this is the spell shop. Uh, maybe it was. So we're having a convo. Let me see what this says. Ba -ba -ba. Something you rarely see. We're showing him something. Maybe the new character we got has something on him. Ooh, moo. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, moo. This one is quite old. If you like, could you sell it to me? Uh, 
Husk ta. How much will you buy it for? It's basic Toskata, the first thing he's saying Is like, I'm saved or we're saved 10 gold Dana <laughs> Baka <laughs> Pretty sure it's Baka Yeah, Baka Iten jane yo Don't be silly 60,000 and 100,000 gold. <laughs> I should have done that at least. <clears throat> what? 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 Okay, with a uh, 50 gold exchange here. Oh, 150 gold. Yes, thank you very much. See, so we sold our sacred shit to him automatically. There was no choice in the matter. Yeah, we're not equipped with two items, but we kept one of them. We have the something or another. We have cloth clothes. They basically stripped us naked. And we just sold all of our crap for 150 bucks. <laughs> it's it's kind of sad. Sad fate for MC here, but you know, it is what it is. That means we're not all powerful now. Uh, we have to go buy the ticket now that we can afford the ticket from the lady. Guess you gotta do what you gotta do. Now that we have a ticket, we can ride the boat. It says to talk to this guy, but we just walked right past him, so I guess you don't have to talk to that guy. Unless I meant to talk to this guy. Yeah, this ship's gonna take us to a place called Yold. We get to hear the sailing music somewhere. So this is all a prologue chapter. I think we're just gonna be walking around and the game might be a little slow to get going. It's gonna be very talk happy. Happy, heavy, talk heavy. We'll see. Uh, there's nothing to do in Yold apparently, but I'm gonna talk to the NPCs that are here. So anyone who can understand the language can enjoy the dialogue. This town music's really nice. <laughs> For some reason, they just nailed it. It's like a remake, a slowed down remake of the original town music, if I'm not mistaken, from the first game. So the first game's town music's very upbeat. Uh, 
And I think this is similar to how town music used to be. Da, 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 da. I can't buy any arms. This is gonna leave. No, there's more up here. Let's see what's going on up here. 250 gold. 600 gold. I don't know what he was talking about exactly. <laughs> oh, there's another dude in there. Seems like it'll be an important area later. The heck? Interesting visual effects just happening randomly. Is this like a power plant or something? They're generating electricity here. You don't see that in RPGs very often in this era like animated background objects I can't do anything with this it's just random right yeah okay <laughs> curious very curious I don't remember that in the first game at all it's gotta be new do, 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 do. I think we're good to leave. I uh, can't go back this way. Alright. I'm just being thorough. Did I talk to these people? All right, we need to, uh, go down here, I assume. This place is called Serisu, which is where we need to be. And we're looking for a cutscene of Proc. But we can talk to uh, all the dudes and dudettes while we're at it. Whoops, that one went fast, but it's okay. You guys can pause <laughs> when it's on YouTube later if you really want to see what he said. Make you work for it a little bit. Dun, dun, 
I'm not sure what the uh, old man was doing. I will say, when I'm trying to avoid the people, if you walk into them, you talk to them, so it's kind of a little hard to avoid them sometimes. What are you asking me for? So I don't want to waste their 50 bucks. Would you like a cup? Hi. Oh yeah. Anatawa. Something or another. I think he's questioning her age. Yeah, say this here. We need to go to a place called Nash. Bum, 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 I wonder what it would be like if you had a full-blown RPG and it was just the world's at peace. I think there's a game that explores that idea. I don't know what it's called, but I think there's an indie game that has that concept. Yeah, I didn't test what name this was to make sure I'm in the right location here. And it'll be good for me to learn which towns are where on the map. This is Nashu. Nashu. Okay, we need to go up here. This is apparently Gerald's mansion. We're looking for one of the main characters who were introduced in the cutscene at the beginning of the game. Or during the intro sequence. We're looking for the green haired girl. Allura. I don't think she's joining us yet. Mm-hmm. 
What is that? Googa. <laughs> is this a kid or a baby? Gagu. Goo ga ga goo. <laughs> this guy is saying. Okay. <laughs> so the green haired girl up on the top right is who we need to talk to. Apparently we just have to leave town and come back in town. She told us to come back in a bit. So this would be one of those story triggers that would be very hard to figure out. <laughs> We've done it before though. Never forget Legend of the Eight Heroes. I forget the full name of that game, but that one didn't have any guy to walk through. I still can't believe we beat that game too. So we stumbled upon some seriously obscure specific tiles for specific triggers to do specific things. Truly astounding. go to the other side. How's the fighting in this game? It's like RPG mechanics. It's standard RPG mechanics. So what's the dragon slain count? Zero. We've slain some s slimes, as the game calls it. We bullied some slimes. Slime bullying, apparently a favorite pastime of our, our hero character. He likes to skip out on studying so he can bully slimes. Was the exact dialogue. <laughs> I call myself a dragon slayer. Hey, every dragon slayer has got to start out somewhere, right? We're currently a slime bullier. We'll get to the dragon slaying, probably. Actually, I'm not even sure. This, to be fair, in the first game, there's only one dragon in the entire game. There's no other dragon. And it's only the final boss. And he's already slain in this game because, you know, this game takes place 20 years after the previous game. We are the son of the hero from the previous game. So technically speaking, I don't even know if there is a dragon to slay currently. Playing an asshole? No, I'm a slime bully. Slimes equals bad, and bullying slimes is okay. So therefore, we are not an asshole in the technicality. There's gonna be a lot of talking before we get into fighting. I can tell you guys that right now. This game actually has some plots set up. It's very dialogue heavy. So far. Alright, so she's warping us back to, uh, well, first this guy. What are they up to? Maybe just sliming around nature? They are just sliming around nature. 
nefariously sliming around nature. Also, what's good, Kyle? How you doing today? And I forgot to check what kind of magic a rando has. Rando. The new guy. Such lovely town music. It's not a long loop, but it's not an annoying loop. Washino Kara Kara Kawaii something. Green dialogue right there. I guess this guy was sick or something. She helped him out. <clears throat> so we're back in cities. That seems important. What have we got? Red text, yo. Red fucking text. The only problem with the red text, unlike the white text, uh, the red text is really hard for the translator to pick up for some reason. It's really hard for a translator to even remotely come close to correctly identifying this stuff. Or I say translator, I mean OCR. The OCR cannot figure this out. Hold up, I almost got it. Thank you. Twice to my eagle floor. Sally Brick is a poor background. Yeah, red red font is not typically a good font. Isn't red? I don't recall exactly, but isn't like red one of the hardest colors to identify? Because of how lighting works. Or how our visions near spectrum works, or is it purple or something? I forget which one it is. I think it's red. We see the least shades of red. I'm pretty sure. Okay, so we are... wait. We're not done here yet. We need to go into the castle. <laughs> and uh, 
we'll just talk to the NPCs here. But what we want to do is find the king. Because this is going to be the second of the four kings that we have to deliver a message to. Do they have like a moat in the castle or what's the deal with this perspective? Is this the castle, right? Let's say this guy is blocking my way. Can't get to the guard. <laughs> nice library. Okay, I guess we're going upstairs. This would be the king. Mm. So this is uh King Erion. And we gave him the, the thing that we're given the four kings. Actually, almost done with the uh, prologue chapter. Just gonna hit up these other guys. So let's see here. We need to find a place called Sueru to activate a new scene. So we're gonna look for a Sueru. I believe we've always spoken to all these people out here. So we're back in the place we arrived at. We need to go around. Oh no, this was the southern place. And then this is that place, and we need to go down from here. This way. Dun, 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 dun. I'm guessing this is not what I'm looking for. But we can fast travel here now. This is city. I don't think that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> we'll be back here. If necessary. This is Sureru, which apparently translates to swell. Sureru. Ba -ba 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 
No, I don't want you again. So we get this automatic rest cutscene at this inn. <clears throat> this is an uh, important combo. We'll, uh... I shall attempt to uh... get this. Okay, this is um the person who owns the inn. What's up, Jigo? Are you asleep? Do die, Jigo, and the Oh, I Hey, is that Haley? That should be Hey. Hey, that sleeping mushroom was one shot. Sleeping mushroom. Sergei, Sir Sergei, Sergei, right? That little ya is silent. Well then, let's move on to things from all over the country. I'm not a scumbag who won't kill you. Apparently, I guess that's supposed to be. I'm not a scumbag who will kill you. And this is heh, hey. This is Aretsina Deskakoya. What is that? Let me show you something. <clears throat> That's a big deal. Kid is not the Prince of Farlane. I guess we're talking about us. Hey, Prince. <laughs> I don't know if that one translated right. First line is, hey, I'm not tickling you. And then hurry up and take me to Aja. Yo, what's up? Try again. And this uh, other one is Y. Very elongated Y. I don't even know that anymore. You you are okay. Ikai. <laughs> Do. Okay, are you? Rock shoot. Is <laughs> yeah, you see the gameplay for the new Mogaro? Looking smooth. Smooth as hell. Max dude got to play it early. As he tends to get to play games early now. Listen, let's take this guy to his hideout and collect the ransom. Once you understand, you can definitely decide. Yeah, I think they're trying to kidnap us or something. This is like the dude who ends it in talking to some other dude. As expected of you, Gina. <clears throat> I understand. So this one... So what will this old man do? 
saw Japanese Twitter comparing it with the old Garo and not sure if JP players were happy or criticizing. <clears throat> Who can say? I'm surprised they would try to compare it to the old game though. It seems quite different from how the old game functions. Very modernized. All right, money doesn't matter for something like this. Leave me alone. And then come on, let's go. Goo, 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 no, it should be Gizu, Gizu, Gizu. Japanese language is so weird sometimes. <clears throat> wow, I'm going now. <clears throat> and the. Uh... And Terry does a super in the old game, he moves forward pushing stuff while in the newer game he stays in place. Well, yeah, there's going to be differences. I do agree with what Max said on one point. The Buster Wolf and then Hotaru super, I think, all of their like big super moves lack that sort of impact. And I think they lack that impact because they made them multi-hit instead of one hit. They both used to be one single giant hit. But now they're like multi-hit energy moves and it just doesn't feel the same. And I think that's a mistake on their part. There's no reason for them to be like multi-hit it just doesn't induce the same feeling. <clears throat> anyway, I stopped paying attention to uh, this scene, so. There's still some shenanigans going on. So we are basically taken away. And now we're at, um, let me see where we're located here in the bottom right. We're at Boadukayun, board shipping, like B-O-A-R-D, board shipping. Gotta say, Atlas here is having a hell of a time doing what he's doing. Going on this little adventure of his. He's been robbed, he's been kidnapped, or smuggled or something. Ditched.
I can see why this game may be daunting for a translator to tackle. There is a tremendous amount of dialogue and we are still only in the opening of the game. something at the same time here. Okay, I'm gonna try to remember that there's a secret waterfall entrance <laughs> for the future of this game. Okay, so we're back in, um, do I do? Yeah, we're back in Suedu, where this whole thing started just because we slept at this inn. So don't ask me what went down, but with the game thing is asking us to do uh, is to farm actually now I'm not gonna adhere to that advice we'll we'll grow stronger later but I do want to see something uh, if the experience has changed or if monsters have developed around so this saying to go back to Rondo and then Liesel I'm just gonna go to Liesel which was really early in the game? Where the hell is Diesel? It's not Diesel. It's not that place. <clears throat> Is it this place? Yeah, it's these Sedu. <laughs> I just want to see if there's still slimes or if more advanced enemies showed up, and they seem to be slimes still. Yeah, but we do like no damage now. We have no weapon. It seems like our ally is getting hit.
most of the case if XP is divided between the two or if it's all shared in this game. So will we both get four here or will we only get two each? It's two for my guy, and the other one doesn't even gain anything. So, yeah, we're gonna not worry about that other thing. We're just going to return to Sedis, which is over. So, Sedis. Yeah, this is Sedis. Da, 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 we can get a grind on later when we actually have a weapon. I assume we're gonna inform this king of what happened. King Aerion. This silence always gets me. Hence movements in games. Oh, there we go. Just as uh, a little info on what's happening, there's, there's uh, like monsters spewing forth from some newly opened pit. Which hasn't happened in 20 years, so it's a big deal. I just knocked my microphone, so I apologize if it like popped. I wish there was an extra verse to this tune. This tune's a little short on the loops. Did that guy just fade away? Oh, that seems like a big problem outside. <laughs> What are those? Weird robots with balloons on their back? Damn, King is kicking ass though. Not move, so this is a cutscene.
Yeah, I made it to chapter one. Or soon, I guess. Ooh, a portrait. Exotic. You always burn your broccoli? Well, most vegetables, you need to tend to them constantly if you don't want to burn them. Or you cook them on very, very, very low heat over a longer period of time and you shouldn't have a problem. Like it burnt? Why'd you post a Bible thump face initially then? That suggests that you do not like doing what you did. stuff going down. I see, I see. I'll try to keep that in mind then. As you were. Yeah, I wouldn't want some burned pizza. Unless you're into that. People that are have rather exotic tastes. Truly a refined palate.
Okay, we are free from the dialogue, except I want to hit up everybody and get the uh, dialogues. Ooh, what is this? Pelvis parent meeting. Uh, I gave the per I gave I'm giving the letter. back home I think yeah I lost all your money yeah I'm sorry I was robbed the poor pathetic MC couldn't do anything about it We should be able to make money by fighting now. Oh, the music's different. Huh, town music changed, eh? Uh, we don't need to be here. Oh, now we got enemies in the world. Oh, it's, it's just how I remember. I still have this other guy with me. I need to, like, buy a knife or something for my guy. Oh, my. What is the second spell that this guy has? Because I think they have the healing spell too. They have Bulham. Well, we're gonna try it. Oh good, they have a fire spell. Okay, so we're gonna be reliant on magic to survive here. Now, yeah, I can't cast again, so I only have enough MP to do, like, one cast per... I should have saved before we came out. Oh, I can't even cast this one. I guess I'll heal myself. I just stealth the spiders. <laughs> stealth slimes. That would be terrifying. Nice crit. Nice crit. So oh, one damage critical hit. Oh, they crit me. That sucks. My uh, dude is super dead. It's like the crab boss and blaster master. 
Alright, let's see if we can flee, I guess. And we revive automatically. Oh shit. There's four of them! Alright, they can kill me. That's okay. That's actually not okay. We're gonna have to skip through the cutscenes. Ah! <laughs> I'm trapped! I'm not gonna be able to escape from them. Right, I need him to kill me and hope we just like respawn in town or something. in town and in this game we want to wait for a mana to refill you can see it's charging up because we don't have money for what you call it so this is gonna be pretty unique I gotta say not the best design considering how this magic system works so I have to wait for it to heal up. Yeah, let's take a look at the... Uh... Item shop. Oh wait, I didn't mean to get that. Well, I got that. What did I buy? I was button mashing to get through the menu. This is a collection of responses. Interesting. I don't think this place has a uh, open store. do we're going to look for a three spider fight we can set one on fire and then slowly kill the other two but if it's a four spider fight that's too much for us right now i have no idea how we would survive against these uh bird things so try to ignore the bird things all right, three spider battle. I'm going to need a critical hit. <laughs> and some other good RNG. Right, because I can't do the fire attack twice. I don't know what that status effect is. Pretty rough start for this game. <laughs> Unless there's a. I could warp somewhere and look for like a simpler monster. Oh, how'd that guy die? Was it that status effect? I'm not sure. We have a problem now. 
Yeah, I wonder if that status effect is uh, death over time. So I'd have to get some sort of super crit on the other spider in order to kill it. And I can't heal myself. I'm willing to try. Uh, he died. Oh well. <laughs> we'll check out some of the other areas and see if we can find some easier monsters to slay. So we need money. We might need to buy some basic gear and then we can do some damage. Waiting around for MP to refill is weird now. That's very weird. We didn't even fill them the full this time. So there's variants in your spells. Interesting. Uh, this island is dangerous. We're gonna try uh, over here. Oh, wait. <clears throat> I want to refill my magic so we get the one heal in combat. And I need the one fire spell cast. If we can find a group of monsters, there's just like two monsters instead. That would be, that would be ideal. We have to find our ideal battle. That is not our ideal battle. Okay, it seems even more dangerous over here. Let's uh... like a look around this area okay there's three of them I would like less than three if possible if I just look tough they do look tough they look very tough. Let me try towards the cave over here. We could go through the cave again back to our hometown. And I need to heal my guy. Let my mana bar refill. I don't exactly know how this mana system works either. The fire spell won't shoot unless the two bars are filled, but it only takes up one bar. Nope, we don't want this battle. I would have accepted two speeds, but... Two speeds and two birds? That's crazy talk. And we're able to run away. Fast enough to flee. No, these are no good here. Seems like there's no monsters in the cave. This just leads to over here. I think our best bet is to get lucky on a triple spider battle, but we can't have that status effect. <laughs> <laughs> if 
If only he could shoot fire twice, that would be great. And we got that status effect. Excuse me. <clears throat> and spiders are bullies, man. We just can't handle the spiders. I have an idea, but it probably won't work. I'm gonna have an idea. This person doesn't sell her buy. These people in the hometown don't sell her buy. I mean, Nobunaga's blessings be with me? Indeed. This thing is the torch Taimos. It's only worth four gold though. And this other thing that we got is 38 back. No, I think we're just gonna need some good RNG here. Because we had no monies and no means to uh, get a weapon. Let me see something. Giving this guy, a main guy, the weapon that the other guy had. Which I think is the knife. And he still has a charm. The other guy is gonna be a wimp. We at least have a weapon on our main. And we have a fire spell on the other guy. <laughs> hey, once again, we need to kill a three spider squad <laughs> by some miracle. Like the Nibunaga game I played, where you conquer towns on the world map. Speaking honestly, we've played probably five, six Nobunaga games. And I'm not sure which one in particular you're referring to. <laughs> yeah, there, there were several games that work like that. We played, um... Uh, Nobunaga's Chronicles. Which is like Nobunaga Koki or something. We did we did a bunch. And there's plenty more to go. There's plenty, plenty more to go. I was not ready for this hardcore of a JRPG experience. It's probably my fault. But I mean, we couldn't make any money prior. And this is at last, yeah. Pretty sure. Let me check the spells. Yeah, this is Atlas. Oh, I should see if I can teach Atlas. That's better. That's better. 
That helps. Atlas has the DPS. Alright, now we just need Atlas to not get hit. And the other guy can just stall. Come on, Atlas, you need to roll higher than that. More than five or seven. There's. Whoops, attacked the wrong target. There's four more than five or seven. God damn, I've been poisoned by both of these bastards. I'm gonna take a risk. We're gonna try and kill this spider. Good. And then I'll heal on the next turn. Oh dear god, the 20 damage hit. Oh dear god, the 10 damage hit. Atlas can just get one more swing in. That's the wrong character. Atlas, swing your sword. Die, die, die. I need four hits with this other dude. We need the other dude to get poisoned and not killed by basic attacks. Poison me, spider. Alright, that's good RNG. One more turn. Oh, spider would let me have it, man. Those OP speeds. Alright, we can reload the save game now instead of waiting. So you don't have to wait to heal. <clears throat> man, this is rough. They're <laughs> just trying to get started. It's a lot of monster down there. What happens if the spider poisons you and you die, but the spider will die as well? Because you hit it when it's falling to the ground, would that technically be a deuce? I think you went out of your way just to make the deuce joke. <laughs> yeah, we don't want this encounter. We want the three-man encounter. Twelve results, seven of them games with Nobunaga's name in it. Damn. That's a lot of Nobunaga. Oh, the spiders are being brutal, man. They're being brutal. Being brutal. Ugh. Atlas has to attack. The other guy has to heal himself. So he can be a meat shield for Atlas. Right, this is the best RNG we've had so far. Holy shit. As soon as we get proper gear, we'll be fine. <laughs> hey, right, get RNG, get RNG. I haven't played three of them. I'm telling you right now, there's gonna be more than three Nobunaga games left to go. They just don't have Nobunaga in the title, maybe. Am I out of deuce nowadays? Yes. There's a tennis game coming up once we get through this RPG and then um, uh, a couple other games. I'll be back on tennis. We won a battle! Holy shit. 2 XP. 3 gold. Oh dear god. I sh well, if we die it's whatever. Oh dear god, they're worth nothing. The grind in this game is going to be hardcore. Are you guys ready for this grind? Holy shit. These devs are insane. I got some kind of item. I have to translate what I got. Who knows, maybe they dropped like a weapon or something. We got a spider fang. 
Hey, <laughs> what is this? An antidote herb, Dokukeshi Kusa. Yeah, they would drop an antidote herb, wouldn't they? Nine games with the word tennis in the title, I've only played four of them. I've definitely played more than four tennis games, though. I think? I feel like I have. I feel like we have. Alright, I need to find a better place to farm. Or a wizard guy who can teach me a spell, maybe? Because if we can learn a maho, that would ease things up. So we might go talking around towns. I have an idea. I'm gonna wanna save first. Coming over here. I think this is where the uh, guy was who was talking about ma magic. In one of these houses. Not this lady, though. Yeah, of course, of course. That makes sense. That would be a tremendous amount of research on your part. It's understandable. I wouldn't bother. Those speeds are only worth one XP a piece for three XP total. And we need six more XP for my main character to level up, so that would be two more spider battles. But we need 52 XP for the other guy to level up. So the other guy is going to be useless for as long as we don't have a weapon on him. Well, at least he's got one fireball cast. <laughs> That is, uh, is there nobody in this town who has Mahal? <laughs> Still working on the Grand Blue Fantasy Wiki? That's madness. Oh, they have cheap gear here. Ooh. Well, it might be worth selling that other thing that I had picked up if I can get, like, a weapon. Okay, that is not... ...what we desire. This, though. Top option. It's a small sword. Kogata no Surugi. Small sword, though. What is this 30 thing? It says car armor. And I don't know if I believe that. Because we saw the scene with the spacesuit people. So it could actually be car armor. <laughs> That's probably not correct though. Alright, I need sixty dollars, guys. I need sixty bucks. Oh, she only sells. Uh, here's an item shop. We're selling their torch. I'll buy another one later. We're selling this thing, which I wish I didn't purchase to begin with. And it is worth four gold. I have a pension pennies, and this is kind of funny. <laughs> it's, it's kind of funny. 
We're, we're gonna get the short sword, but we gotta survive another spider battle. So I'm gonna go back to this area. We're gonna try to survive a spider battle here. You know what? Hold up. Before we, uh... I don't need armor on my character, right? <laughs> How does this armor sell for? We can always buy armor again later. Hey, you. Oh, yeah, I can't sell here. Hold on, we're going back to the other place. So I will sell my armor if I can get a better sword. And then they both have a sword to swing with. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Eight bucks. We have 49. So yeah, I'm gonna sell this. We're gonna strip the MC of his cloth armor. I'm gonna keep the charm. And we're gonna sell our cloth clothes too. The shit I do to survive in Japanese games. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Buy a short sword. Excellent. I have to be careful when I'm menuing with them. Alright. Grind time. Hope you're all ready for grinding for the next however fucking long it takes. Get the equip. I want the short sword on this person because it's going to be superior. Yeah, 15 instead of 10. And then you can have the uh, other thing, the knife. I'm gonna save. And hopefully spiders don't wreck me when I'm not wearing any uh, protection. Uh, we don't want to be here. This is the wrong place. We want to be like the second one over here. <clears throat> I will praise this game because they give you warp. At the very beginning, infinite charges, <laughs> but holy shit, couldn't they give me some spending cash and not rob us completely blind for the beginning of the game? Seems a little ludicrous. Could also at least make the enemies... Tolerable. We do not take damage well. That's okay, I'm just gonna mash select and reload and we'll try for better RNG here. I don't want this double bird spider spider battle. Even if the birds are worth more. It's not worth. Triple spider bust. Also, I need to keep this in mind. If we're ever stuck on an enemy, I can mash select faster than we can walk away from it. But we seem to be loading into the same battle RNG every single time. This is not good. They also seem faster than me. Which is not good. Here's what I'll do. We're gonna walk out the bottom exit. That should change the RNG seed. And then we'll come back up here. <laughs> We're gonna hope that changes the RNG seed. So we want a uh, triple spider. This is the easiest encounter that exists. That's not triple spider. You know what? I'm just gonna yellow this. If the fire kills a bird, 
Which it doesn't. <laughs> Never mind. What's well, our main character is really slow. It took us turn last after everything else went. Okay, we finally got triple spoiler. Oh, hells yeah, we one-shot them now. That, that sword was totally worth buying. <laughs> Alright, now we're on track to make some fucking progress. But we gotta kill a lot of spiders. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, yeah. That's... that's... 2 XP, 3 gold. <laughs> Closer to being here, is, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's so bad. I need my MP back, so hold up. This is the other thing we have to do. I have to wait for this MP board to refill so I can cast fire again. Oh my guy. Isn't that great? Maybe it's just rough for right now, but I have a feeling I'm really going to dislike this MP system. And we could rest that in, in, and I think that would heal our stuff to full, but that costs money. GG for this part of the game. Yeah. Seriously. Jesus Christ. This is a little ridiculous. They tried something new. I don't know if it's working out how they imagined it. I would try to fight these things. I'm curious if Atlas could kill them, but I'm guessing he cannot. Also, we can't take a hit for shit. I know I sold my cloth clothes and all, but seriously. Alright, here we go. This is good. That's fine. Burn a spider. Slash the other spider. Alright, we're just gonna have this guy defend, which is... This command? Oh no, that's the auto battle stuff. I defend is the bottom left. There you go. Oh. Atlas. You can kill him in one hit. Now you crit. <laughs> One more battle and we will level up MC. Isn't that amazing? Now we get to sit here and wait for our MPs to refill. Wait, I don't want to talk to people. It'll stop the refill. I was a little excited for this game at first. I'm getting a. Uh, I already don't like this though. Oh, I feel conflicted. It's got some streamlined stuff. It's nice to move around quick and... I just, I'm not driving with this mana system. This is way too rough. Also, the early game is just rough. Why, why is it like zero XP gain and one gold? It's one one gold and one XP per kill. They're, they're worthless, these things. I'm not asking for the finest riches in the world, but you could give me like five bucks per spider. Come on. 
Let me make some gold here. I thought you could cast that for a second. Alright, nice crit, nice crit. Level up. I oh, know we got a, we probably got another antidote thing, which is an extra four bucks. Although, if the poison in this game is an instant death after a few turns, I might want to keep some antidotes. Yeah, that's another antidote that we got. Now let's just wait for MP. Um, hmm. I could attempt to find a better fight that's worth a bit more, or we could just stick with this because they're probably I will die if I face off against anything else. This is gonna take a while. Oh, this is Atlas. Hey, don't kill my boy now. Alright, whatever. As long as somebody wins this battle. This will be a good test too. Does the dead party member lose XP or gain XP? It says EP3, so I'm guessing they uh, lost XP. And that all went to Atlas. I'm not sure if my guy was at 46 prior or not. Now we wait for mana. At least the bars refill at the same time. At different rates, I guess. Maybe they don't refill at the same time. How restrictive magic is going to be in this game. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, that was the wrong character to attack with. That was a good battle. And another antidote, so that's another four bucks. Assuming I sell that shit. Also, I think we can recharge our stuff on the field, but I'm doing it off field just so something doesn't run into us. <laughs> it would be lethal at the moment. I have 20 gold. We have 28 gold if I sell the two antidotes. 
I would like to um, get armor on my guys, which I think was 30 bucks a piece. <laughs> I think once we get through this beginning part, it probably won't be so bad, but this beginning is going to be rough. Oh man, I would like to try this battle. I'm going to burn a spider, because we've seen fire doesn't work on the birds, unfortunately. Yeah, I would have to like one shot a bird or something to stand a chance here. So they just do raw damage. Alright, we tried. I assume the second option takes me to the main menu instead of back to town. I have to get really lucky for the bird fight to work. We have to have a better turn order. But I can do spiders. There you go, an antidote. So that's another four dollar doodahs. I should have enough to buy an armor piece, so I think I'll do that. At that town that we were at. And slowly but surely we will make our guys good again. Yeah, I think it was 35 exact. I need to be on the inside. I need 50 and 40. I mean, $90 for each character. Oh, dear lord. Oh, get out of the way, kid. Get out of the way. Final Fantasy did it best, and no one has done it since. I think only one or two other games have done it since. Oh, I didn't mean to walk out here. This is probably bad. We'll try it. See what happens. Oh, I don't have mana ready. Hold up. We'll leave. I'm gonna fly to some other places and see if we can't get a... A better battle than triple speeds. Speeds are safe, but three golds is the uh, three gold ain't cutting it. Yeah. Let me just wait for my guy to get his healing MP up. Save the game in case we die. Let's go fly to I don't know. We'll go to the third continent that we were on, which is huge, by the way. Yeah, let's go over here. What do we got over here? 
Like two knights? How bad could two knights be? Yeah, 12 damage, fire, 23 damage, physical attack, not so bad. Right? Totally survivable. I did one damage, my fire. One damage. Alright, we cannot survive this area. <laughs> But we can run from battle. <laughs> okay. Can't survive there. How about over here on this side of this island? Or is it just the same stuff? It's the same stuff. Huh, my controller turned off. And there it's charged, so that's weird. Oh, it says it's not charged actually. It's blinking around. Can I plug you in but have you stay connected to the SNES? Okay. Might have a bit of a technical problem. So I did leave my controller plugged in all last night. I usually leave it plugged in, but I think... I think the one USB port, my computer's got four in the tower. I think the fourth one, which I seldomly use, is like not working or dying. Or sometimes it works, but it needs to be reset. So, okay. If I plug in the controller for it to charge, it will uh, lose connection with the SNES. It can't do both simultaneously, unfortunately. I have a solution for this though. I'm gonna do something, it might be a little risky, but I'm gonna do something. We're going to swap controllers. I happen to have a genuine SNES controller here that I use as my two player but I can switch it over to first player the other one is a wireless what is this one 8 bit though it's a wireless 8 bit though but the first one is my first generation Super Nintendo controller that still works somehow after all these years, this thing is as old as I am. Alright, let me just uh, clean my thing a bit. I haven't used this controller in a little while. It's a little dusty. A little schmusty over here. It's working though. Buttons on this one are a bit rougher. But we're playing an RPG, that should be a non-issue. Alright, my guy survived, he's tanking, he's tanking like he should be. Which is good, 
We're gonna finish off this one bird. Yeah, let's get a hit on this bird and then hopefully Atlas can kill it. Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna switch controllers back again in like an hour or so. Just make sure this one is, um... Hold up, trying to make sure it's not paying. back here. I should probably adjust my wiring. Okay. Uh, hmm. 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 Untangle. Gotta move the controller through the loop. Here. Carefully. Okay. That's a little bit better. I can't believe this thing still functions. And move some stuff back. Set up. That's all set up. This should be over here. This is charging. Alright. I think I can uh, focus on the game for a while. When I'm done streaming tonight, I'm gonna have to look into my USB port and see if I can't fix it. Usually reset, fix it. Yo, six gold for that battle? Holy shit. That's amazing. Six bucks instead of three bucks for the increased danger. What do we need? We need like 50 and 40 because it's 90 bucks. Oh, right now we need to wait. thing about this controller I'm remembering it now the start button which is my save button is working but it takes you you gotta press really hard my start button is definitely not on point every other button's fine with start buttons the one thing is like you wouldn't want to play a shmup if you wanted to pause pause buffer with this controller <laughs> It's this battle again. We got the first shot here. Oh, 
Yeah, that's pretty good. My guy should live. Alright, we're looking out here. Another six bucks. All right, we just need three more. I did not get an end there, right? Nope. This is my Wapu. We don't sell that. <laughs> I don't think we can sell it. It's not on the list we sold. Gotta wait for that fire to recharge. Anytime now, game. Trying to hit start. Vicious beasts. I was hoping to be triple spider. That's all we need for armor. For the first piece of armor. And they're mostly attacking the second guy, I've noticed. Not Atlas, so I'm gonna give the armor to Rando. And we'll see how the AI continues to behave. A good extra four dollars. I wonder if this is the full world map or if there's gonna be a secondary one later. I'd like to purchase this 30 foot car armor or whatever the hell this is supposed to be. Right, his defense is currently zero. It's now 10. Hells yeah. Assuming it's a one to one ratio. <laughs> That's some weird scaling percentage thing. Then, uh, that should be perfect. Turn those 20 damage hits into 10 damage hits. Keep farming. I want at least one more armor on my other guy. And then we can try to find no, I need I need to buy it the second short sword too. Probably. Ah, that's much better. <laughs> Seven damage. From the spiders. Another antidote. Let's 
Let's make sure we stay inside of the town. It's safe in the town, you know? The town is safe. Don't be focusing on Atlas now. Let's heal our boy. So they're definitely focusing on our boy. Give it this bird. This is a pretty terrible start, I have to say. We are very underwhelming characters. Now, I'm cool with um, a hard opener. Like, SMT can be brutal. And, uh... Etrian Odyssey and stuff, but at least in those games you have cool skill sets being built from the get-go, or you're assembling your team, your initial team in SMT. This is pretty brutal. We're just sitting here. It's brutal because we're sitting here waiting for mana to recharge. And on the one hand, we have seemingly unlimited mana. I don't have to buy like potions. I don't have to waste the money on in. On the other hand, it costs time. It costs a lot of time. And more speeds. They're coming! They're coming! Oh, 
Oh boy, 12 gold. 37 XP when we're making about two per fight. Means we need 15 battles. 15 more battles to level up a gun. And maybe be in a slightly more significant position. <laughs> it's mostly armor I need right now. I need some equipment. Okay, did not get enough for my fire back. Nice crit. Nice crit. Oh, he's so tanky, Rando. So tanky. This triple spider, we can handle two battles before we go back. Oh, I thought I didn't make it into the town there for a second. Things do I have to sell? Let's sell them. I can't do it here. Can I do it here? I can't do it here, right? I can do it here. That's an extra 12 bucks. I feel like I can make a Seth review video in this game and just re retell the story of my journey through it. Hey, hey. Harpu here. So we were in the starter town. Pinching pennies. Every single antidote. A precious $4 investment into a piece of armor so the Creatures in the very first area of the game do not utterly slaughter us mercilessly. And we might be able to start heading deeper into the game. Yeah, MC, you're supposed to crit these birds. They're a problem if you do not crit them. Give it to this bird.
Healings for chumps. Damn. Hey, let's just leave. My guy's not gonna survive this battle. I forgot to hit select. Sometimes we're lucky, sometimes we're not. Oh, right, we're on a different controller here. I can't. I guess the select button is not as responsive. You could kill me. That's fine too. Select button is more responsive than the start button is, but. Did I sell my stuff in this? I did. Okay. Alright, triple speeds! Triple speeds is better than the birds. I mean, the birds would be fine, but MC has to crit. Birds are not fine if MC does not crit. We probably still would have been okay if I had actually healed my MC a turn sooner. I was hoping to clear out the birds and it just didn't work. Us. Oh, that's not good. Bye, my guy. Birds are extra brutal, yeah. I forget if I saved after the fight. <laughs> I was like, wait, let me uh, run back if I can. I almost didn't make it. have the $50 armor for at last. Then maybe I can try fighting uh not these but whatever the second group of enemies is. Let's see if we get some increased gains. Cannot load scum, we have to retreat. Uh, 
Oh, I can't use fire. It's a good start. That's a very good start. We are both toxic. That's not great. I really need to get a short sword on my other guy. If he didn't crit there, I think we would have lost that battle. Instead, we are going home, survivors. I did not mean to heal MC. Thankfully, it didn't waste any mana. Since the second bar seems to just take longer to restore, I wonder how bad it's gonna be for the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and the eighth of bars. My saving right before an encounter is a death sentence. <laughs> Fine in this instance, but that's not something you typically wanna do. I mean, we could always just go back to town we did, so I guess it's fine. We won't soft lock or anything. Just need five more bucks. If they would drop an antidote, that would be great. I was hoping he wouldn't find me. Oh, that's the bad encounter too. Oh, I did not mean to hit the speed. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Oh, this is bad. Because he's going to die of the poison. It crits on MC. And MC died. <clears throat> Mash R to teleport. Strats.
And we wait. Oh yeah, waiting. <laughs> okay, we shouldn't need the heal on there, dude. If we do, then the fight's going poorly anyway. Really took damage, but I want the fire. Two more bucks. Yeah, I didn't drop any antidotes for us to sell. Soon we'll have. A shield, I assume, on uh, MC. Huzzah. <laughs> One more spider battle. And then we can start working on our next goal. <laughs> Just leveling up. Right, we're gonna try a, a more difficult encounter once I get a shield on MC. And see if it pays better. This encounter it sucks, honestly. Okay. Let's go get a shield for our hero. And let's heal him while we're at it. I do wish she had to hit a button to talk to townspeople. <laughs> so much better than contact. Contact! Yes! We have armor! And defense! Hells yeah! I need 80 bucks for the other two pieces of armor. Try to fight something. I'll try the stuff that's outside of this town, I guess. Why not? We get one fire cast, and then the other guy is still useless. I would need 60 bucks to get him a better sword. But progress? Getting stronger <laughs> so very slowly. Alright, through these things, right? That should be totally fine. Let's see how they like fire. 
They look like a fire being, to be fair. I assume that's confusion or some shit. Yeah. I think my guy is uh, unable to be controlled. He is auto attacking. 14 on a crit. It's not bad. Alright, we're both confused. We're hitting ourselves. It'd be nice if I could heal my dude, but I guess we can't. Yeah, Atlas is killing his friend. The monster is killing Atlas. Oh, good. I'm going to attempt. I assume this doesn't work on a fallen person. I just have to get super lucky, right? Okay, the same working. I think we could win that battle, but MC cannot get confused. So if there's like some squealing, my desk is uh, getting old and rusty. Uh, this looks doable. These things look vulnerable to fire, right? Yeah, 13 damage. Okay, so this is a battle. Now, nice crit. Solid one damage, my guy. Alright, solid 15. Uh, damn, they have lifesteal attacks? Because why the fuck not? Yeah, that's fine, it's fine, it's fine. They're allowed to have lifesteal in this area. It's a bit annoying, but... <laughs> so what are you gonna do? Okay, I have to heal my MC. <clears throat> this guy is gonna defend and hopefully take hits for Atlas. While Atlas finishes the job here. Or they're just gonna target Atlas. God damn it, why does this keep happening? Thank you for the crit. Finally, they hit the guy he's defending. <laughs> Stop hitting Atlas! I can't heal him anymore, and I need him to kill you. No! Atlas crit! I have to swing at this fucker. Oh, come on. It's lifesteal attack on these things really sucks. <laughs> Atlas, you got a crit, bro. You got a crit. Oh, thank God. Three EP, three gold. They're worse than the spiders. I mean, they're basically the same. Oh, is it three gold each? Because they're at seven. Wasn't I only at one after the purchase? I don't know. Maybe I was at four. Oh, that sucks. I wasn't expecting much better, but I was hoping for better than three bucks. A 3P! Oh, this game's grind is on the hardcore side. It's not gonna get better than this. Even once we get our characters, like, established here.
I could attempt to make some plot progress. <laughs> Maybe we can get a third character in the team. It could be a game changer. To have a third person. When do we get a third person? Alright, we do get one soon. And we have to go through a dungeon. And we have to be the boss. It seems. So that's not going to be a viable strategy. We're going to need to be capable of beating a boss. Huh. I wonder how boss fights are going to be in this game. I'm going to need healing items if I can only cast a singleton healing spell at the moment. Uh, these enemies of life steal aren't really ideal. We know we don't want to be down there, so I'm gonna try over here. <laughs> oh, whoa. Alright, let's pour these things, but let's see how bad they are. Don't do that much damage. Vulnerable to fire. Kinda. Kinda works. Hey, our crit does not okay. Uh oh. Alright, I have an AoE team attack. It's fucked up, fam. Like, you can't be critting you. But I can be, yes. That's how this works. I crit, you do not. I'm gonna keep defending with my guy and... Greeting attacks with Alice here. Ooh, hello roll. That's bad. And no reason to risk it, right? Let's just heal up. XP and four gold. I would say a worthwhile encounter, but Vol? Rest in peace, Randa. It's a tad lengthy of a battle, but maybe worth it. I have to wait till we heal now. The one that's level four. I don't know if that's gonna be a significant increase in our power for surviving, but one can hope. Mm. 
I need to adjust my steering. Okay, these things, so uh, let's see how this flying thing is. Oh my. I'll try to set it on fire. Okay. It's pretty nice. Yeah, okay, flying thing is down. We'll defend and let Atlas do all the work, ideally. Two damage is not great. Gonna need those crits, Atlas. And keep tanking, keep tanking. Probably not a worthwhile encounter. But we'll see. Let's finish off the sky if we can. No, we cannot. I'll start working on the next one, though. Oh, nice crit. You can finish off that one. Nice crit. Yeah, it all comes down to the crit. Crit RNG is high. <laughs> it's, it's high. Kind of passive, but not that damaging. They gave me an item. For EP7 gold, we got the best encounter yet, boys. The best encounter yet. Seven gold and a mystery item. Which means there was more than seven gold. So I'm probably selling a mystery item. All right, what is this? The eyes of Koshua. Koshua no me. Eyes of Koshua. Might not want to sell this. This is, if I recall correctly, something that will let you see in the uh, dungeons. I don't want to test that. Wait in town there so we don't get encountered because we definitely needed their mana. Two more of those battles for a level up. How much does the eye sell for? Eight bucks. Probably will sell it later. We'll see. What the da This group again. If 
Aia! Attack! Oh, I do a lot. There we go. One down. Oh! Oh, that was bad. Thankfully, it's our turn. Getting crit is no bueno. Hold them at bay, Randa. Hold them at bay. You are a tank. No, Randa, you need to take the hits. Randa, you need to take the hits. Oh god, they're vibrating. Let's hope he would finish that off. I'm gonna heal myself. Have Atlas heal himself. We're gonna need to crit one of these other ones. Not ideal RNG, but not impossible from this point. Gotta get a critty. Critty, critty. You better put your dukes up. Alright. We should be fine. Thank god I blocked. <laughs> Okay. That fight is a little monka. I think for speed consistency, we should stick with the spiders. We're getting the same XP. Spiders are just slightly safer. And while that seven gold is nice, it's not like a significant increase over three. So I'll take the slower gold growth over more consistent and safe battling to save time here. <laughs> I'm gonna need to refill my drink soon, not quite yet. But soon. Take a little break to do that. I guess after the break I'll see how charged my other controller is. Swap back. A much safer and faster engagement. Sometimes the speed is all you really need. Granted, we're waiting for our fire to recharge after every single one of these battles. So this MP system sucks. <laughs> This MP system sucks. I'm definitely not jiving with this mechanic. At least they tried something different. It's not sticking, but they tried to be different. I don't think any RPG has an MP system like this. At least nothing that we've played on the SNES so far. 
nothing else that I've played so far. One more XP for our guy. Eh, it might be okay. I'm gonna have my guy defend and we'll just have uh, Atlas hopefully slaughter these. Nope, that did not work at all. And then you defend with your one boy, and then everyone else just bullies your other boy. The fuck? Yeah, take all the damage, you're about to die to poison anyway. Atlas, please, you have to crit these birds. There's just no victory if you don't. Thank you. Only 9 damage? It sounded like the critical hit, but only 9 damage? Now this will tell me for sure, because I haven't been paying attention. So, our second guy, Rando, only needs 1 XP to level up. If he does not level up here, then we know that they do not gain XP. And because those numbers are changed, I think it's counting how much EP your main character gets and everyone else gets divided. Yeah. Alice leveled up there. I saw two, five, and a bunch of ones. Oh, I did not heal my dude. No, not like this. Run away. Mashar. <laughs> No match for the speed of my Wafu. Okay. So we're level four. Oh, there one boy, anyway. It's a significant HP gain. It's like 10 HP or something. Not quite 10. I suppose this encounter isn't that bad, and hey, maybe we, uh, yeah, maybe we ace these things now that we're level 4. <sighs> I 
This encounter is much more tolerable <laughs> So I would like to get the weapon on the other guy so that his physical attacks actually do something What's this game like? Just another JRPG? Yeah, it's another JRPG. It's got some unique mana system going on that I'm not a huge fan of. And the grind seems to be on the very heavy side. I would say, no wonder this one didn't make it overseas unlike the predecessor. Farming seems heavier. But look at this. 2 XP for each of them and 3 gold. I think f just 3 flat gold. And the enemies are pretty dangerous. <laughs> Took us a while to get started here, but we're finally making a dent. I suppose I should focus on the turtle fight. Again. My guy missed. Yeah, what's good, Medio? Health pairs, things. And shearing if you've been shearing. Yo, what's up, decoy? Turtle fight. Yeah, we might want to go back to those enemies now that we hit level 4. See how we do against them. So don't have to worry about poison with them. They didn't seem that bad overall. Well, we got insta-killed by the p spider's poison shit, so... That is a shame. But not a big deal. Just a waste of some time. We need 73 XP to hit the next level. That is fucked up. It wouldn't be so bad if we earned reasonable experience. Oh, wait, let me get my fire. <clears throat> we need 60 bucks for the weapon. 
I only got one of those eye things that I can sell. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting I could hit X as a shortcut for spell casts. That's eight bucks. So we have 54 bucks. We need six more. One turtle fight would give us enough if I sell that eye. These are the turtles, by the way. I don't know what they actually are, but this is what I was calling the turtle battle. <laughs> they look like Bulbasaurs a little bit. A bunch of precursor Bulbasaurs. Hell yes. Hey, these guys don't seem so bad. Why that dude doesn't even do damage, so I should just tell him to block. But, uh, for those of you joining us, this is a very... Seems like it's going to be a grind-heavy RPG. I expect a solid pass. I don't know how long it is. It doesn't seem long to get through the story parts, so most of the length is going to be from farming and making sure we're capable of beating bosses. I would guess this will probably be like a 30-ish hour endeavor. Give or take. If I can find a GC location to, uh... Get away with farming. Hey, yeah, it's time to increase our other guy's damage. Hold up. Oh yeah, I could sell his sword too. That would make some money. Equipment. This guy. Sword doll. Unequipable. Oh, I have to sell it to the item shop because the weapon shop doesn't buy. Oh yeah, it's worth eight gold too, so I can keep my other item. My Eye of Joshua, or whatever the fuck it is. One sword, please! Alright, we're broke again. Well, the life of an RPG protagonist sure is a tough one, isn't it? Hey, yeah, 18. Wait, we don't want to select that option ever. Okay, so we have the same stuff, except the other guy has 70 magic power. The main character... The game it gave... This is why we're critting so much. The game gave our main character 15 luck in the auto stats. So we are all attack and all luck. Which I'm fine with. We're just crit attacker. I would have preferred a little bit of extra speed, but whatever. Apparently speed is not prioritized in the distribution of stats. Alright, let's see how we do now that our other dudes got a sword as well. I would like to wait till he gets his fireball recharged, so we gotta sit here for a second to recharge the meter on the right, the MP bar.
This right here reminds me of Mega Man X3 Gold Armor. When you when you get damaged, you just want to sit around and let your energy tanks refill and shit. Okay. Hell yeah. And our other guy, who used to only do like two damage to these, can probably kill this now. Hell yeah. They're vibrating! Interesting. So the different MP bars, I shouldn't really think of them as bars. You probably assign spells to slots, if I had to wager a guess, and then you can only cast the spell once. So you can probably assign the same spell multiple times. Damn. That's going to be a problem later, isn't it? He should attack the other one. Whatever. Huh, <clears throat> <sighs> those things are not ideal to encounter. And we should probably recover him the full. So, what is my next goal here? Make enough cash to get the remaining two armor pieces. That's 80 bucks. <clears throat> 80 bucks. Hey, what's up, chill? I got two people with chill in your name in my chat. You love SNES? Me too. The system is wonderful. You ever heard of this game? It's a JRPG exclusive, yeah. Japan only. The sequel to Dragon Slayer, which did come out in English, but not on the SNES. Came out on the TurboGrafx-16. I missed. Decoy is a fake chill and is to be removed from the gene pool. Damn. Well, so it was declared, so I suppose it shall be, perhaps. I'm not responsible for this, though. Nice and healthy. These critters are deadly, yo. Everything in this game is deadly, yo.
What season is peaceful? Ooh, tough luck. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no bad things happen in the winter. Yeah, it's uh, as a reminder for those joining us, we have to uh, wait for the MP bars to charge in this game because that's how it works. And uh, there's a lot of idling because of that. And we have to wait for the second bar on our second guy, Rando. Because that is a fire attack and we want access to that. <laughs> Yeah, I, I do not like this mechanic. I kind of wish they s just stuck with the way the first game worked. It was much better. Yeah, this is not the encounter we want. We want the other encounter. This encounter sucks. Glad it doesn't do that much. It is a lot of channel points. It's mostly for dumping excess points because I don't really have anything to spend channel points on. Yeah, critically hit. Should have got it for zero channel points at Christmas. Yeah, I offered every single one of you a free question ad, and nobody took me up on that, so. <laughs> I did not receive any questions from anybody. Maybe next Christmas I'll, I'll provide the same offer. I like that I've upgraded from spiders and birds to blue gremlin monsters. I did not mean to do that. Alright, well, there goes my $8 I was going to sell. Because I was button mashing. And because we earned the XP and gold, I'm not going to reset. It's whatever. It's whatever. The wrong guy. Oh, what a dude. Size of Joshua, a nice way to scout the map though, and dungeons and stuff. I didn't miss the town music in the first chapter of the game. When the world was at peace. Try something. We never killed those butterflies, right? I want to see if we can handle those butterflies. Let's see if they're any better of an encounter. I die to confusion, but they didn't have a lot of HP. And there's this thing too. Whatever the hell that is. 
probably get rid of the butterflies first. Fade away without any sound effects. Oh. I need a crit. That's not a crit. That's not so bad. Three and four. It's just not worth it. <laughs> None of them are worth it. Ah, we need a battle that doesn't drain us. Or that's worth the wait. I doubt I can handle those knights just because we hit one level up. While we're here in uh, Liesel, we may as well do the next. Uh story progress we have to talk to the king here just on Okay, so now that that's done, we can proceed to the next step. There wasn't a guy here who could teach us magic, right? battle this battle would hypothetically be okay if we rolled well so these things aren't that bad they just have the life steal attack
That's a one-to-one -one ratio lifesteal attack, by the way. That is a one-to-one, 100% -one, lifesteal based on damage dealt. That's a lot of lifesteal. <laughs> There's got to be a better place to kill stuff. <laughs> uh, we don't want that menu. So enemies being chintzy on their item drops. We haven't gotten anything in a while. S N E S. What's up, little track? We played a tiny bit yesterday, and then my I got sick, so I had to stop. And now we're back today. Feeling better so far. Grinding in an JRPG. <laughs> Oh, how much idle time this game is going to give me. It's gonna be like watching the AI play in the tactics game. But it's okay. It's all part of the adventure. This is not okay. Uh oh. I don't know how this fight is going to go. If I get a crit here, it might go okay. <laughs> we also have to avoid getting confused. I might want this guy to block. That is bad. I was just hoping for good RNG. And I can't heal my other guy. And I can't control my main character. So we're just gonna buy time. I hope that MC goes on a rampage here. Okay, it's not confused anymore. I should have killed the other thing. Just to get rid of it. Damn, there goes my critical hit. Buy 10 minutes from me for $3 Canadian. Um, hmm. My time is precious, so I'm gonna have to charge you more than 3 Canadian dollars. What a battle! Unfortunately, your other character doesn't get anything. Fortunately, our main character gets eight whole XP to himself. Oh yeah, look at that. 48 more XP to go until the next level. Do you even have $3 Canadian surge? Just curious. And if you do, why? <laughs> even full heal anymore. Already outdated spell. Only level 4. Okay. 
making an executive decision once again. Even though the spiders are only worth like 3 gold and 2 XP. With their stronger level and both guys having weapons, I can probably kill them far more efficiently. So it's probably better to just do a bunch of spider battles. Poisoned. Got some SNES noobs in the chat. Tisk tisk. I didn't go nearly as fast as I was hoping it would go. <laughs> this is a grueling battle. Gotta go drink with your buddies. Oh, hells yeah. Drink responsibly, but I hope you have a good time. You'll be watching. Your buddies are gonna be like, why are you watching a dude grinding a JRPG? Wait, I got an item. We got a uh, antidote. That's an antidote. Antidote. Not explaining your addictions to me. Fair, fair. We don't judge here, though. You know, if you ever want to share, you're always welcome to share your stories in this chat. Consequential amounts of XP! And money! I almost have 40 bucks, guys. You know what I can do with 40 bucks? We can buy clothes. We can buy the armor for a character and increase their defensive abilities. goal is to get a question right. I wish you luck on your journey, for the bot has a significant amount of questions. And some are easy, but some of them are not so easy. Where'd I source them from? My brain. They're all genuine Harpu questions that you will not find anywhere on the internet except right here in this Twitch channel. I spent 
a significant amount of time on. <laughs> a a non-income. Boy, this guy has a healing spell? I had no idea. Yeah, non-inconsequential amount of time has been spent on the bot. I work on it a little bit every time I'm bored. I'll just add some questions to it. I'm slowly adding every game. How many questions are there? Um... Probably over a thousand by now. I don't know how many exactly, but it's definitely over a thousand questions. Oh, I can't heal. We have not regained our healing at mana. That's okay. We're actually sh making some progress on these battles here. Yeah, when I, I have a general category that I add to occasionally, and then game categories. And I try to do 25 questions for each game. The general category has more than 25. It's got some odd amount. And then there's viewer questions, of which Sarge did submit one. With his points, he paid for one. So his question's in there too. I've been adding the games in order, so it's all the earliest games that I played through currently. Should save. I got 53 bucks. Let's go buy that armor, shall we? Actually, hmm. Instead of buying the armor, how much money do I need for the next weapon? And where can I even get the next weapon? What about this port? If I can do more damage, I don't need defense. You gotta... you do have a person. 300? What is this for 300 though? Aoyagi no Sulogi? I don't think that's a weapon. What is this other stuff you're selling? Don't, we have this one already. Yeah, we have that one. Second one. So the third one is available at the other shops too. Yeah. So this is what I was gonna buy, but let me see if I can find... I don't know if this is a weapon. It says a gi. So I think it is an armor. Sulogi. Sulogi. No Sulogi. Let's try a different town. See what we can get. Try this one. I hit the wrong button. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Wait, we're already there. Let's try this one. God. Don't touch me. <laughs> this, this enemy should probably fuck us up. Some fierce. I don't think these guys sell any 
armor. Did you have an estate? Okay, we can't go forward there. And there wasn't like a second area to this. Alright, so if not there, we could try this town up here. Or did I already try this one? I thought I tried the other one, but it might have been this one. It was this one. Stop hitting B! It's the A button, it's Japanese game man, the A button selects. Item store. Yeah, this is where we were kidnapped or whatever. Okay, there's no armor shop here. How about this place? Wait, wasn't that the prison cell? Oh, you can fast travel to here, huh? Da da da. Da da da. -da, 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 -da. This is where they were keeping us. Maybe it was safekeeping, you know? Don't see any sh shop a ruse over here though. I take a random boat and go somewhere? No. Damn it. Alright, so narrowing down locations. I can't shop there. Oh, I haven't tried this one yet. Did I try this one? It's hard to tell. This says the item shop. I did try this one. So the bottom right landmass does not have any weapon storage so far. So we're relying upon the top left one. The ticket girl for the boat. Which I don't have a ticket for now. Otherwise, it's just items. Could 
try this town in the middle. You old men, do you have spells to share? Could use some spells. I don't think they have a shop here at all. Oh, their guy wanted to come here. Interesting. The guy is uh, the leader of the party now. How do I do that? I have two things to sell. Two antidotes. Quit blocking the door. <laughs> this is a guy who tells you about stuff. Go through all of these. <laughs> so I didn't have any weapons here either. The only thing I can get the short sword, and then that's the cave. Huh, can't fast travel to every location. Oh no. You missed the Super Mario World question. Tsk, tsk. <laughs> oh, they killed this town. I wonder why. We can't go here. Those monsters destroyed the town. Oh, dear lord. Better heal. Orange HP. I'm in danger. like that question. That feeling when you realize the bard is the most powerful character in raw stats, but you don't have him for very long, so you don't really get to play with it. So many monsters on the field. town is this town? This is the wizard's town, right. I 
All right. How far are we into the game? Not very far. We're on the first chapter. There was a prologue chapter. We complete the prologue. Uh, I don't think there's that many chapters. It's like only a handful. The thing is, the pacing of the game is gonna slow us down dramatically. Alright, I'm gonna buy the extra armor. I don't know where I can pick up a weapon from. Or I could save up for the $300 thing. I could save up for the $300 thing. So maybe it's a weapon. Yeah, who needs the antidote? Sell them. Sell them all. We're kind of penny pension at the moment. And I need these NPCs to stop locking doors. <laughs> Oh dear lord. I think I should stick with the uh, fighters or the turtles. The Bulbasaurs. Wait for a man of the refill. Try fighting the Bulbasaur groups. Takes a good few seconds for that fire spell to recharge. I can't wait to see how bad the high tier magic is at recharging. Okay, this is the group that we desire. Only 12 damage, huh?
No, you can't block the tail like this. Alright, I'll try, but we don't have fire cast. And we're down a heal. Yeah, that game takes place in the uh, the huge rally that goes from France to Africa, but it starts in Africa in the game. They don't have the first French run. Sweet merciful seven gold. Humana humana. <clears throat> Alright, we're at 81. Since we're at 81, I'm gonna buy the armor. I changed my mind. It's grinding 300 is gonna be rough. So we're gonna get some armor warrior. Yay, from 10 to 15. Hells yes. Hells yes. Alright, 15 defense, baby. Rolling in the defense. my next goal I want to just hit another level get to five and then I'll see about trying to make progress <clears throat> let me see something else here That's where it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, sorry for standing around. Let's do some farming. I didn't heal my guy at all. I'm sure that won't be relevant. How much does fire do to the turtle? That's the same amount. I don't know what that thing tried to do, but I don't like it. It's 
<laughs> Damn, you missed all the 25% so far. <laughs> This right here might be the best encounter by a mile. I still don't know what that thing is trying to do. taking any damage now. We're also missing a lot. That extra five defense was money well spent. For sure. leaderboard yes there it is you can type in the uh, exclamation point leaderboard I think I'm mostly on there because every once in a while when I add new questions I, I run one just to make sure it works Uh, there is, yeah, it'll, it'll give you the top three and then it'll tell you your own personal score, but you have to score by winning <laughs> at least once to get it on the list. <clears throat> I think there's like 20 or so names on that list so far. What am I waiting for? Waiting for my fire spell. How did anyone know this? If you scroll below the, uh... Oh, you mean a question. Some of the questions are difficult. For sure. <laughs> yes! He's, he's on! If you meant, like, the quiz commands, if you scroll under the channel and to the things, they're listed there. sleep happy tonight I am glad you have done it
Just 10 more XP for MC and 19 for Rando. And that will be level 5? Oh, isn't that exciting? It'll be level 5. Hells yeah. Nice crit. Don't do this attack. I missed. My guy missed. Stop vibrating! go that's a bit better that's what I like to see that's what I like to see and yeah, that's the other guy who did that okay let's uh, run Running, running, we are running. We are recovering mana. Waiting patiently. I heard a dink. We are healing. Should have waited for the second dink. Uh, they, they might have been done. I only heard the one, so I wasn't sure. Does it make sense that they were synced? Oh boy, eight more XP on MC. I cannot wait. Level five, here I come. That's just to hit five on MC. I want to get five on the other guy too. Oops.
Alright, I do need to refill my drink. I'm getting thirsty and I'm all on empty here. So, we'll take a break after MC hits 5. And then we'll do a bit more grinding till the other guy hits 5 once I come back. I'll make a snack too, it's a little hungry. So we'll take a usual food break that we take at some point. And then we'll try and make some story progress. Oh, we got an item. Hells yeah. Some good stat gains. 108 to hit level 6, good lord. Again, it doesn't seem so bad, but when our best XP gain is 4 at the moment, that's just like, ugh. This is the eye thing, right? So I should keep this. I don't mean to enter a battle, but I guess I'll do this battle too, and then save. Now, MC, you can't just miss. What are you missing for? You're the new and improved level 5 hero. Yeah, let's see your power. A level 5 power. Things are going smooth. You know, we might see a lot more of those guys. <laughs> yeah. I, I will look for a better battle again, since we're at 5 now. Uh, after our guy levels up, but... Anyway, I will be back in a few. I'm gonna make a sandwich or something to eat. And uh, refill my drink. Let's leave you guys with some music. So that it's not all quiet here. Uh, let's go with um. <clears throat> this is a good one. A little super turrican. And I'll be back in a few.
Okay, I am back, kinda, sorta. I have, uh, food. I opted for soup. So I'm going to, uh... Eat my soup, which is gonna take some time. But I figured I'd mention I'm sitting here. Enjoy the musics. <laughs> I opted for not a sandwich. I already had a sandwich for lunch, so I didn't want another one.
All right, I. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I inhaled my food. Let me just wash out this bowl. And we'll be good to go to continue. Oh. Not the Yoshi's Cookie music. Oh, this tune is nice. It just gives me memories of playing Yoshi's Cookie. That game was hard. <laughs> Damn puzzle games. Alright, I'm gonna do something. My other controller should have been charging for long enough. So, I am going to... Swap controllers now before I do that. Oh, wait, let me pause the other music. I just want to make sure I save. I think I did when we got here, but I just want to make sure. Because if I swap these controllers around, I accidentally jostle the cartridge in the wrong way. I'm gonna be very upsetty spaghetti. And we don't want upsetty spaghetti. Hey, we're back with the good controller. I mean, the other one's all right, but that start button is really hard to hit. It'll be nice to not have to press press start in really, really obnoxiously hard just to get to register. Okay. Let's get out of the dude to five. It'll be about two battles. I think it needs seven more XP, and these are four piece. And then I will attempt to uh, make some sort of progress. Oh, I never healed my guy. That's okay. <clears throat> Let's just guarantee the kill on this thing. There's only three of them. Yeah, we will attempt to make some sort of progress. Oops. I feel a sneeze coming on, so be prepared. Or it shall be unleashed. Mm, or fade away. Eh, I think it's fading away. Yeah, it's fading away. But they might come back at any moment. Be prepared. Yo, what the fuck? Hey man, how you doing? 
actual SNES gameplay. Yeah, we, we do some actual SNES gameplay here. You're just in time, I just got off of my break. So, good timing. Is there a way to open a secret level by hitting a rock in Sheeran and you don't mean a passageway? A way to open a secret level by hitting a rock in Sheeran. What do you mean a secret level? Can I clarify that? Any clarification? Do you mean like the wishing shrines? I'm not sure what you mean by hitting a rock in Sheeran. The only way to open a secret level in Sheeran is to PayPal him 500 bucks. There's <laughs> legal reasons this is a joke. Honestly, if you say a statement like that, there's nothing illegal about it, and if someone falls prey to that, it wouldn't even be a scam, really. It would just be someone being a dumbass. I don't know if you would get in trouble for that. I suppose it depends on the, the argument premise of false promises. Transactions. How you been though? <clears throat> we we are back on Snesson. It's time to do some damage. We're gonna get into the four hundreds, but this this RPG might take a while. A bit slow paced, so who knows? I'm gonna need a, a few days for this. All right, our boy has leveled. We are both level five. We have all the gear we could possibly have at the moment. Huh, interesting. You see this graphical glitch? Our character sprite is on top of the uh, save thing. How interesting. <laughs> this RPG looks boring and generic as fuck to be the ready streamer, man. In, in due time, brother, in due time. Alright, we gotta go somewhere called Yold, and I need to do some name translation because I don't know where Yold is. But we've been there before. Uh, I just don't remember what city is Yold. Also, why is my translator... I exited the translator. <clears throat> By accident. Yord, right, Yoruto. Yoruto is where we're going. That's why I don't remember where Yold is, because they have a different name. You thought you can remember attacking a rock and it opened a doorway. <clears throat> this is Sheeran 6, right? When you say a rock, do you just mean a wall? In a past game. Ass game. Have you played Sheeran 3? Well, wait, instead of me remembering this. What? What are you playing right now? Like, what is this question directed towards? Or are we just throwing out a random question here? You're playing 6. Oh, okay. Well, in 6, there's the, the Wishing Shrine. But there's no, um, there's no secret doorways in rocks. But there can be wishing shrines in the walls. And as such. <clears throat> Just rolling warp to the end credits like a true gamer. If I knew how to do that, maybe I would. It would save us a lot of time. But at the same time, I kind of want to experience the game too. It's got nice music. Music's the best part so far. Unfortunately, the mechanics are kind of low tier. They're original, but they are low tier. Uh... 
have to come up here and go in here and talk to not her, the green haired girl. <coughs> Played one years ago and thought it was a thing. I think, I think maybe was the one you played years ago in 3D? I'm thinking it was Sheeran 3. But, uh... It's not really a standardized thing. It's just exclusive to 3. You're playing Barbie and your sister's puppy rescue on the 3DS. Thanks for asking. How's that going? And why aren't you streaming it? <laughs> Isn't that part of the challenge? Are you just doing DS, not 3DS? Well, I, I know you changed, you changed your plans on that whole thing. Okay, so we spoke with her. And this guy comes in. Concerned, uh, we, we need to buy some potions or something before we do this next bit. <laughs> you really gotta stop lifing and start streaming. Nothing wrong with lifing, honestly. I think lifing can be a solidly fine choice. Streaming's fun too, but it can be a lonely road. <laughs> Oji sama sama ga. Oh, he added God to it. Prince Sama. So surprised. I always hear OG for like an old man. I didn't know OG was Prince too. OG Sama. <laughs> Okay. Could have been on Dreamcast. Ah, oh, Suka. I haven't gone far with the Suka myself. I've only played a little bit of that game, so I'm not as familiar with it. Oji sama, Prince Oji san, old man. I guess the. <clears throat> yeah, it is. It is a uh, O U J I. It's a O J I. There's a different kanji word too. Just making sure I talk to all the peeps. <clears throat> Alright, 55 
bucks? Oh yeah, this place with the electricity. Crazy how every single bit of Japanese knowledge comes from anime. I don't think it's that crazy, honestly. Because there's a lot of people in the same boat. There's quite a few people that have learned their entire Japanese understanding from anime, manga, and shit. I like that. Nothing wrong with that, I think. You probably get some inaccuracies here and there, but it's nothing wrong with that. It's a start. <clears throat> Alright, what is... It is a torch. The five dollar thing is a torch. That's the Taimas. The uh, top thing that's 50 bucks is that weird thing that... I have no idea what it is, because it's like a desu no ha. Los leaves. <clears throat> Lesu no. Lesu no. Lesu no. Senkata Kana, so I was hoping saying it a little faster would make me understand what it's supposed to be transliterating into, but I have no idea. And the other thing that's 10 bucks is a Joshua's eyes. So I could hope that this Resuno is a heal or a revive. I'm not sure, but we're gonna need a torch. We're gonna need some torches, so I'm gonna buy some torches. I think, I think, we're going to have a hell of a bad time. Um, I don't want the equipment menu. I'm going to top off my character. Na, 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 na. Da, 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 da. I'm gonna wait for my mana to heal. I will attempt to make progress. Let's say that. And when it doesn't work out well, we'll have to farm some more. I'm just. We only have two heals. So, this is very concerning. If I could. Let me look around that town and see if I can get another heal. Oh, we can't handle these guys, can we? Do we do damage to you now? I don't do damage. <clears throat> we are going to want to, uh... Probably level up some more. I mean, we don't do a lot of damage to them. I guess they don't do a lot of damage to us either. And that's just the way this game is. Let's see how good the farm is here. We might want to hit some levels. Although... This isn't that bad of an encounter now. We just don't hurt them. Of course he's alive, silly. He's an anime protagonist. There's no way he could die. You'd argue he's the dad of the anime protag. They're never around most of the time. Interesting argument to make. Now, what kind of father trope are we talking about here? Because there is the one that's never around, but still having their own adventures. And there's the one that's, uh, probably not around because, you know, they're not around <laughs> anymore. 
Which is obviously not the case. It have to be the former. Five XP? Holy shit, eight gold. This wasn't like it was that bad of a battle. Or maybe these are better. Got new enemies. I missed. Nothing quite like missing on your first turn. <clears throat> yeah, we don't do any fucking damage. Um, I don't know what that means. Did they just silence everybody? I can't cast spells. I can't cast spells. I can cast spells? I can't cast spells. I'm pretty sure they silenced everybody. That's what that means. I will say, it's nice to see status effects. They didn't have that many status before in the first game, so they upped the sophistication. I feel like they missed the mark on the... Uh, Damage ratio? Like, I don't mind tanky enemies here and there, but this is a little ridiculous. <laughs> we're, we're also apparently tanky now. Some good crits. Some good crits. Do damage without a crit. Setting SDOC, SNES Doc. One, one of these days, I need to go a Nightbot and just make the. I think you can tell Nightbot to detect a second term. One day you'll remember. And one day I should make it so. Was an alias. I should set up the alias to be DOC. So there's a lot of people that type that in. I didn't pay attention. How much XP did that battle give us? Does anybody, anybody pay attention to that? <clears throat> I'll just have to fight it again. I only need 88 more. Yeah, I think we should level up again now. Would it be conflicting if I have multiple docks? No, Nightbot has a thing where you... If you, you're saying if I add another document, I will make the command different. <laughs> if I add another document. EP5? Was it 5? Oh man, this $300 item is probably really nice. Yeah, EP would be experience points. Alright, we're just gonna farm a bit. Run Saber up next. I've never played Run Saber. I don't even know. I assume it was a anime platformer. Action platformer thing, but I noticed Run Saber was never released in Japan. So it's actually just uh, Ameritrash. <laughs> or Eurotrash. 
say that in a loving way, by the way. Like at the board game. A mere trash board game and you were trash. Post a screen cap on the save there. Yeah, 5 experience. 11 gold though? Whoa, 11 gold? That's hype. That's new record. This is the best enemy group yet. It's not very threatening. 11 bucks per battle? Shit, sign me up. <clears throat> Before I start the Game Boy portion of SNES SSG. I better get my ass in gear. We'll see who gets started first. <laughs> I'll likely do it just because It'll be nice to keep doing SNES quest related things. So it's like, why not at that point? If I'm gonna clear everything on the console, we can include Super Game Boy. Plus it'll continue to feed me more content. Hot, hot content. homebrew action too well, I definitely want to play some of the modern released games but not all of them have ROMs uploaded online so if you guys want to see some uh, modern SNES games I have to buy the carts which means I'm gonna need some uh, subscriptions and donations wink wink it's for the channel <laughs> I don't know if I'll do ROM hacks. Well, I'm definitely not going to do ROM hacks. Prototypes, I was planning on doing prototypes afterwards. I was going to do unreleased games, prototypes, if they, if their ROMs exist, and modern releases. I wasn't going to do ROM hacks, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing all SMW ROM hacks. There's way too many ROM hacks, and a lot of them are extra extremely difficult and for advanced players only I feel like something like 70% of Super Metroid ROM hacks are for people that know how to speedrun Super Metroid and there's no way you're getting through them if you don't know how to do some crazy advanced techs how much does the fire do to you? Two damage! Nice. Excellent. That's great. Mando Metroid Ren. I don't... I don't think I want to do Mando Metroid because that also requires you be skilled at doing things. I know you can change the settings make it easier but I like true chaos randomizers if I'm gonna do them damn they're critting me too much I haven't crit them at all but now I crit them but yeah for Metroid you can you can get some stuff that makes it really impossible to win uh, if you don't know how to do advanced skips but the only thing with Super Metroid I can do is get early Super Missiles. 
and I'll probably try to do that when I play, which means I can skip Spore Spawn. <clears throat> but uh, that's, that's about all I can do with my Super Metroid repertoire. <laughs> I don't think I even know how to... I don't know how to Crystal Flash. I vaguely remember how to do advanced power bomb special attacks. Let alone moon falling, mock balling, and any other advanced technique. Super Metroid plus Link to the Past Multi Worlds or Pog. They are two very, very lovely games. How could you not want to play A Link to the Past? It's so fun. This is going much better than that last battle. Never mind, he healed. It's crazy how mid of a franchise Zelda is. I think when it comes to Zelda, in comparison to a lot of other things, it's much slower paced action, so obviously it's geared towards younger players and more casual audiences. That's why it's so successful. But yeah, they are kind of mid-ish. I think the 2D ones are superior to the 3D ones. with Zelda Zelda 2. I've never beaten Zelda 2. I never really played it for long to be fair because I never really owned the game. Oh that battle takes a while. No I didn't heal. Excuses. Perhaps, perhaps, factual. Facts can be not excuses. And simply facts as they are. Okay, we should, um, heal my guy before he, this enemy that silences, silences me. You like Zelda 2 and Oracle of Age of Seasons? What is it about Ages and Seasons that you like? They are pretty good. I appreciate them too. I do like uh, Link's Awakening more than the Oracle games though. like they're pacing better I got so lost on Oracle of Ages as a kid I think it was like the 6th or 7th dungeon or some obscure thing that you need to do to get into the dungeon. I could not figure out what the hell the game wanted from me. <laughs> I had to put that one down for a while and come back to it a few years later. I don't even remember what it was anymore. Yeah, 
had to shoot the moon? Perhaps. Perhaps. <clears throat> You're one of the very rare handheld gamers at heart. I don't know about rare. There's a lot. I think there's people that, you know, like yourself, like handheld gaming more than uh, console gaming. It's a reason why the Switch does so well. Oh, the son of a bitch. You like games? Sometimes it's hard to believe that statement. <laughs> with how critical you can be. It seems like you don't like to have fun with games. At times. Switch handheld experience is awful though. Hey man, it's uh, on track to outpace the PlayStation 2 in terms of sales, if I recall correctly. So. People like it, what can you say? <laughs> Sarge, why are you lying? <laughs> It's fine to be critical of games. I'm just saying it's surprising to hear you make that statement that you like games. I mean... <clears throat> I don't... For example... I don't hate what I'm experiencing right now. I would say this is a weaker JRPG. But I'm still happy to go through this experience and whatnot. I'm not gonna bash on it. I appreciate the hard work the developers put in. I'm a lot more lenient to things than other people are though. And I know that. Oh god. We've been silenced! This looks like a game of all times. So this is definitely the GOAT. It is the A game of all time, for sure. <laughs> Maybe not the greatest, but definitely a game of all time. <laughs> is the dev Nihon Falcom, yo? Legend of Heroes franchise. Falcom, that explains it. Whoa, Falcom is not the worst. Alright, they're not a Jalico. Not even close. You can't you can't be that harsh on Falcom. But this right here is a bona fide JRPG. I mean look at these damage numbers we're doing. It's crazy. <laughs> the uh, values that we're working with here. Which is fine. I would say I prefer this to the alternative. The alternative would be uh, Vilgust. I don't know if any of you remember when I played Vilgust. And that game just has insanely high numbers and nothing but big fucking numbers to grind. This is better than Vilgus. It's just weird how grindy they made it. God, I need a critical hit or I do no damage. There you go. Good crit. Get another one. Damn it. My guy is dying. He's gonna get zero XP. game is three years before the first Ease game? What do you mean three years before the first Ease game? We've already played Ease 3.
There have been numerous Ease games before this came out. The original release of this game is on 85? Was it really? Are you sure? Are you sure? 85? For Dragon Slayer 2? That doesn't make sense. Are you sure it's this game though, and not some other Dragon Slayer? You like Star Trader on the PC-98 Smilers? <clears throat> I can't take that comment seriously with that emote. Zanadu, also known as Zanadu Dragon Slayer 2. This isn't Zanadu. Though, I think you got your games mixed up. Because it shares the name with a lot of other games. Yeah, this is not Zanadu. This is A.U. Densetsu. Dragon Slayer 2. <laughs> I should probably heal my guy, huh? Oh, I don't have any healing spells. Well, we're just gonna hope for good RNG here. And then I fucking missed. Yeah, you actually do. You like the art style, pop. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. Sub series that shares the same name. This isn't a sub series. This is a main series. There's just there's different games have the name Dragon Slayer in them, and they don't have any relation to each other. There are multiple Dragon Slayers, but this is A.U. Densetsu Dragon Slayer. The Legend of Heroes Dragon Slayer. And I do not believe this came out in 85 at all. Wow, that was a close encounter. What are we setting at? 63 XP. Ah, oh, shit. <clears throat> well, I'm not doing the PC-98 challenge, but I'll play the SNES port. Dear God, let me... Let me run free. Alright. We have to get into a town. Let's wapu out of here. Seven seventy nine. Oh, we're never getting there. I'm gonna die before I get there. Let's be real. <laughs> Yeah, maybe someday. <clears throat> maybe when all of these long RPGs are behind us and we can play some of the shorter games on the console. So we did knock out a couple of shorter games before I took my break.
I would not mind the combat pacing in this game if they just gave you more gold and XP for the battles so that you had to do less of them. I think that's that's what really kills me with this game. This shit is worthless. These enemies are worthless. Trust me, I'm aware of how many more RPGs and tactical war games that I have to play through. I'm very well aware. You know, out of most of the consoles, the SNES probably has some of the longest video games to play through. Just in terms of raw gameplay length. Between all the war games, all the lengthy sports titles, if you're going for credits and not just the single game victory, and the RPGs. Paladin's Quest? I think I played Paladin's Quest already, did I not do that? <laughs> Wait for all your 100 hours edutainment titles. I will wish you the best of luck with that endeavor. I think I played Paladin's Quest. That sounds familiar, anyway. Paladin. Yeah, I did play Paladin's Quest. Took me 21 hours to complete. That was not too bad, honestly. 21 hours for an RPG is really not so bad. I'd say that's uh, on the mid to shorter end of the scale. They have listed the Dragon Slayer games and the Dragon Slayers games. <laughs> Who's the developer of the game set? That's all that really matters, yeah. Is it Falcom? If it's not Falcom, then, then it doesn't matter. If it's not Falcom, then you're talking about different series. Is this Falcom? Then I guess that's that. <clears throat> Maybe this has been released all those years ago on all the old computery things. You can't hate Falcon. Just said you like two of their RPGs. At least. Could be more. That means you like Falcon. Ooh, we got some item. New item! What did we get? Oh, it's red. Maybe this is an equipment or something. Something no yadi. Oh no no Yali. Yo, we got a spear of fire. Oh, that better be a DPS increase. Um Hells yeah! 20 damage instead of uh what was the other thing? I know it's the same. The other thing is 20 damage too. <laughs> Alright, maybe I'll give it to the, uh... No, I'll let MC have that. We'll give the other guy the other sword. I oh, know, he has his own copy of the sword. Yo, can I have multiple copies of a sword? I cannot. Alright. Never mind. Alright, well, we got a spear fire. I'm gonna save. It's obviously a legendary drop. 
Nah, I need to recharge my mana so I can heal. You like Gudu Mean on the PSP, it's three games now. You're secretly the number one Falcom fan all along. Uh, 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 Determining sub series. Your internet connection is shit. I am happy to report I've dropped zero frames. My internet's been very good for the past few months. Oh boy, my fire spear does one damage. To this enemy. I need to see a crit. You see how much damage the crit does. Criteria of what's written in the wiki. So the same wiki that's typed up by random strangers on the internet who don't actually know what they're talking about, that wiki. That's a good source, I suppose. Same strangers as stream games. Us streamers don't have any greater criteria to accurate information than someone who doesn't stream games. Yes, we are. We are all strangers on the internet. And most of us are not experts in whatever the field is that's being discussed. <laughs> if you ever look at that Wikipedia list of SNES games, all the release dates, you will find a lot of incorrect information. In the actual release dates. So, that's just one example of how inaccurate Wikipedia can be. At the end of the day, it's just people working hard to collect information. And, you know, sometimes it's not accurate. Which is why I asked, so what, what is the criteria? To declare Dragon Slayer as a sub series. What is it a sub series of? Because Legend of Heroes, which is what this is, is a main series. With Dragon Slayer 1 and 2 just being the first two games in the series. And then they dropped the Dragon Slayer. Slayer. Dragon Slayer title. For the future games. Which don't use that moniker. They just use the Legend of Heroes moniker. So if you're saying Dragon Slayer is a subseries, he's really saying Legend of Heroes is a subseries, and I'm just asking what is it a subseries of? Because as far as I'm aware, Legend of Heroes is like one of their flagship franchises. My hero got critted. I don't think my guy's gonna survive this. Let's run! 
I will say one thing. Running from battle is very, very, very doable in this game. Okay, so this fire spear, I didn't really see a whole lot of crits happening. Uh, maybe it's more magically geared because it's a fire spear. So I'm gonna keep the sword on my guy. But I'll give the fire spear to the magic caster and see if he has a better time with it. And I gotta wait for my healing spells to charge up. La de da de da, la de da de da. I find the variance of this spell to be strange. Sometimes it doesn't fill you up to full, but it clearly heals more than like 50 HP. <laughs> so I don't know how it didn't fill us up to full in the previous times. Trying to comprehend the texts. He's got to get his light, your light set, your favorite drink at your side. Put your glasses on, even if you don't wear glasses. Start deciphering. Comprehending. The fact that these enemies have a, like, a potion or something that they use is really annoying. You know what? Alright, after this battle, because running away is free, I'm not fighting these anymore. In fact, I'm just running away now. We only want to fight that group with the two, like, birds and the, the lemur <laughs> or whatever. I don't want to waste my time on the night. Let's just reload the save file. Just... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So, let's definitely reload the save file. Apparently my L button is a hotkey for items. You think that these two games, Dragon Slayer Legend Heroes 1 and 2, are considered part of the Dragon Slayer series, but these two games are also in the Umbrella of the Grand Legend Heroes series. <coughs> There's some kind of hybrid game. Be that as it may, be or not be, which I think is the case. But that, that would not make it a sub-series for either of the series. It's just some weird fused project. Maybe Falcom was combining these two franchises or thinking about it or something. The Legend of Heroes part as a sub-series. I think we, we, we have different definitions for what a sub-series would be. save before we get into combat. Yeah. We don't want to fight these losers. They're way too good. Now these losers. Hells yeah. 
Also, Fire Lance is even pretty good against them. Maybe the knights are fire resistant. So with that in mind, I'm glad I, I killed the knights just to get a lance for right now. It's not often in these old RPGs that the enemy drops a cool weapon item early in the game. So this is a nice little treat. Means I can sell my sword. We almost have 300 bucks, and I can buy that $300 item. Don't know if it's armor or a weapon. I hope it's a weapon. Based on the name, it sounds like it's armor. I'll save before I buy it. If it's armor, I don't know if I want it. Oh dear god, I'm stuck in combat. I'm holding back when I escape. I hate when the games do this, especially RPGs. God damn it. <laughs> I gotta button mash faster and uh, teleport. Gotcha, bitch. Think you can trap me? Think again. Okay. This poor guy, Rando, needs heal. That last needs a heal. And then we need to recharge our magics. Our maho. I'm gonna sell my sword. Forty-five bucks. Hells yeah. Ooh. Oh. Hmm. Maybe I should kill the knights and try and get another spear to drop. How rare is it? <laughs> Out of curiosity, how much does the spear sell for? I'm not going to sell it, but I need to know how much it's worth. A hundred and fifty! Yo, okay, hold up. I might want to spend time fighting the knights. I might want to fight some knights, get another spear. This thing is worth money. It's probably like a turbo rare drop though. What are the odds I actually get another one killing these guys? I'd rather fight these things and just not worry about it. We'll, we'll have other money-making opportunities. I almost have you. I 
Okay, we're gonna grind to level six and then I'm gonna try to fight the boss. If I can even get to the boss. I will attempt to kill these guys real fast just to see if I can get their spear. I realize using their spear against them is uh, not very effective. To hit a crit. I need to hit a critical hit. Critical hit. It's a pretty nice amount of HP Atlas has. Hells yeah, nine damage. Yo, bad guy, listen to me. I need some insane RNG. I need you both to drop the fire spear so I can make 300 bucks. Please. <laughs> Stop healing! That's ridiculous! Why do they have a healing skill? Healing is cheating! Only the players are allowed to do healing. Battle sucks. It's not worth it. Yeah, don't pick on the uh, Atlas. Why can't I do 15 damage with my fire spear? I only do 2 damage. This is a bunch of poppycock. I'm getting convinced that the fire spear. Oh my god. Did, are they able to just infinitely do that? Because how did I ever win the first encounter with these things and get a spear fire in the first place? Maybe I'm a low level. I mean, we are a low level, but we're, we're on par with this enemy. And they're not doing much damage to us. My guy has to crit. Like twice in a row and kill them. That's the only way. But that's not happening, so. Better luck next time, I suppose. The only thing is, uh, I probably should have kept the sword instead of selling it, just because it works on them better than the fire lance does. They seem resistant to fire. I, I got that much. So that's whatever. Maybe this $300 thing we're building towards is a weapon. And then I can have MC pass down his weapon back to the other guy. <laughs> Until I hit level 6, I won't fight the soldier guys. 
only that other group of enemies is worth. Yeah, these three. Five XP at a time, baby. Thirty eight more to go for MC to hit six. Five at a time, right? Eh, we don't want these guys. It's just not worth the time at the moment. Even if they have a one hundred fifty dollar drop. God damn it. I really hope this first boss is weak to fire. That would just be swell. $300 equipment Will it be a game changer? Or will it be a waste of cash? Only time will tell That means eight more battles because they give us 11 gold. I do have some spare eyes I can sell for eight bucks a pop so maybe less than eight battles I don't know if these things have any drops yet.
Always save after every battle. In case we get stuck in a night fight. Okay. That all goes by pretty smoothly sometimes. We get those nice critties. One dude can use healer, which means I gotta wait. Oh shit. I guess we can roll with this. Carried that one. What happened, Atlas? You like missed the hit and you did subpar damage on the hit. Pretty good encounter RNG at the moment. Almost level six. Three more battles. Hells yeah. <laughs> We're about to hit level six. It's so hype. We've been playing this game for six hours plus the two I did yesterday, and we are just about to hit level six. After eight hours of gaming, that is a hardcore grind right there. Damn. 
granted, a lot of the first few hours were me translating Japanese text to try and understand some of the plot. <sighs> oh, I'm getting a little tired in that food coma. I'm gonna go for another hour or so. Push for seven or eight hours and then we'll call the stream. I would like to beat the first boss, at least. We almost had 300 bucks, we're almost level 6, we'll probably hit both of them at the same time. That's fantastic news. thing better be a weapon. It better be a weapon. It is armor, I'll probably take it. Just because it'll help on the boss battle. Not the dudes we are looking for. Ooh, new enemy. Let's see how dangerous these are. Oh, good, we're back to doing one damage. Weak to fire. Eh, six. Okay, 13 on a crit. Alright, 8 damage. Yeah, not so bad, it's not so bad. Alright, another crit, another crit. It didn't seem to do anything to us, so yeah, that was great, that was great. Four! What do you mean, four? Yeah, we leveled up, but what is 4 EP nonsense? How are we gonna regress back to 4? We were just having 5. This is bullshit, game devs. I can't believe... I cannot believe this. Yo. Some of these Japanese games are truly hardcore. This might be one of the most hardcore RPGs I've played on the system so far. It is not free whatsoever. Most of them are like mindless. This one. It's kind of kicking my ass here. I have to sell all three of my eyes. Wait, these were my torches that I had bought earlier. No, I don't have any eyes. Uh, I'll sell it. That's fine. I'm gonna need to buy some more torches though. They're only five bucks a piece. So we got basically lost six bucks. Where's the um it's right here? Just in case this is not at all. I don't want to teleport. 
I'll have to save. It's a lot of controller shortcuts in this game. Three hundred dollar doodahs. Pissed away. It's better be a fucking weapon. It is. Twenty-seven attack power instead of twenty attack power. All right, that's something. That's something. Well, so we have eighty-five HP now. That's a lot of HP gain. All right, let's see if we can kill these knights and get more of their weapons. Even if I just get one, I can buy all my torches back instantaneously. And maybe pick up some of that $50 item and test it. See if it's a healing item or something. Oh, hells yes, that's much better. Oh, yeah. Uh, $300 grind was worth it. Oh, we can actually kill these things. Give or take a, a weapon drop for 158 gold. Oh, I don't want you guys anywhere. I want the knights. Yeah. Let me have at the knights. Beep you. I assume that sound effect is the silence, everybody move not working. And it is this flying creature that's doing it. Okay, our other guy leveled up. So I really just need some money. Just think, if they would drop two weapons, I could equip my other guy with this better weapon and buy a bunch of healing well hopefully healing items buy a bunch of torches uh oh, don't heal MC I need a crit ordering a crit stat Yeah the boy I'm saying I need a crit, but I need it to be a lethal one. And I need 28 damage. Critical hit here.
a single speed run of this game, but the PC version, PC 96 version. 7 hours, 13 hours, 45 seconds. Damn, they already beat the game. Already over the speed run, I'm barely into the first area. Maybe the uh, SNES version is grindier. Maybe they, there's some sort of thing that I don't know. I mean, I could probably survive and beat the boss, so I'm definitely doing some excess corman here. Let's heal myself up. Fuck the damage! Now, with the pacing of this game currently, I would genuinely be curious how they pulled off seven hours. Hmm. I would guess glitches, obviously. Probably. You can, if you could like keep your gear you get at the beginning of the game, your character is actually really powerful. So you start with like a royal sword and shield that you have to sell for money. So if there's a workaround to keep that sword and shield and make progress, then yeah, I can see it. Plus, enemies on the map you can dodge, so that makes it go by quicker. You drop your weapon, drop your weapon. Yo, we got it! 150 bucks? Hells yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's not that bad of a drop rate then if we got another one. So, I'm going to... Hold up. I'm gonna unequip my dude. Uh, even if the boss happens to be weak to fire... I'm sure we'll be fine just beating their ass with the, the $300 weapon. So I'm gonna sell both of these fire sticks. Okay, I got enough money. I'll buy a torch or two. getting some damage going who knows maybe we can uh, get some progress going here where the game is rough in this game it's rough AF ah, and since we have two of these I don't need the sword or whatever the hell that is so I can sell that too it's an extra 45 bucks Okay, so I have two eyes and two torch. I wonder if I can organize my items at all. Or if I can only really use them. Okay, we need to go northeast. To the cave, or the cave, the grave of the royal family. So I need to find the grave of the royal family up here somewhere. I think it's south of this town. I'm gonna try to ignore 
battles here. This is it. Let me uh, translate this. Okay, it translates as Royal Foundation, so I assume this is the grave of the royal family. <laughs> Let's uh, see if this thing works in a cave at night. Treasure chest up above us. Uh, we can get that, and then there are stairs on the top left. I don't see anything over here. Yeah, this item is really useful. I'm just seeing the map, not to waste time walking in the dead ends. I don't see any enemies. Oh, there's enemies, alright. So we're gonna want a torch anyway. Since there's a boss, and I'm aware of it. Try to avoid encounters. I'm gonna have to leave and re enter. Okay, I might not be able to avoid encounters with this. Oh, I can't get through this water. I have to walk around and shit. <laughs> the hell are these things? Direct. <laughs> Alright, let's fight these. Let's see how it goes. Any damage shows a crit then. And I missed. These things look like they would be susceptible to fire. Find a safe place to camp and recharge my healing. <clears throat> Season 3 V0 October. Cool, cool, cool. I imagine they will be going to the Magical city of Pristella. Quite a few things go down in Pristella. What? Oh, 
are these things? They're just like electrified tentacle monsters. Or are they actually cables and stuff? Run from this one. Oh, the torch starts to wear out. Alright, we're supposed to do that to fall down to the third floor or whatever. And the heal and then save. Cursed monsters down here. Chittering, or whatever they're doing with that animation. <laughs> Buy more demon eyes next time. Oh, these are all treasure chests. Yeah. All right. Oh, well, uh, get them all then. Might be a lot of fighting, but that's okay. I guess another level would be beneficial. Probably. before we kill this guy and then their magic will start recharging.
Okay. This is probably an armor piece. Okay, we're at 15. Now we're at 25. So it's some kind of clothing. So that was worth it. <laughs> that was a really good pickup. Instantly quits my other dude. And the other two cheer. What the fuck? Leave him alone. They only do one damage to Atlas now. I might defend with my other guy. There's a huge armor pickup. Ah, oh, you can silence too. Is that you? You think? See, well, I would love to. One does not simply increase your accuracy. Where do you propose I find a good set of glasses? Tell an eye doctor in this fantasy world? Not a chance, fancy pants. Hmm. Okay, the first kanji character is different. I was like, is this the same thing? But no, we, we have hella high defense now. 35 on the main character. That is good shit. I'm gonna hope no enemy comes up here. I need to heal my dudes, so we gotta wait a second. For the... Glad I came down here. Yep. Fancy. Something, 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 Sugogi. Wait, don't I have that already? 
is this thing. It's the weapon. So I could have saved myself 300 bucks. Because it's the same... Yeah, it's the same thing. Alright, well we can give it to the other character that we're gonna get after. The z bows Battle. I didn't mean to heal him, I want to heal MC. slightest idea what these are. Some sort of cyclopean flea monster. It looks like he's got a bag on his back. Another one. Damn. Okay, after this fight, we've got to wait till we can heal again. I don't like the waiting until my magic is ready. That makes me nervous. We have to actually endure cooldowns. <laughs> Magic. Tied the cooldowns in this game when you think about it. Instead of MP. Falcom ahead of the time here. Although, I still don't really like how it's executed early on. Okay, that's new. Se Segusudi Segusudi something Segusudi Now this is not an equipable at the very least it is not for us I don't know if this game has specific gear for specific characters I shall check no, it's just not an equipable, whatever this is. This is a... a consumable. I'm gonna translate it. This is a Kitsukeyaku reminder medicine. <laughs> I don't know what that's for, but alright. We need to wait a second here for Maho. I've got my torch wore out. Okay, 
I think this healing spell is going to be the only one I need throughout the rest of the game. I just need to put it in more slots so I have more copies of it. Or if it will fall off. So far it seems like it heals me to practically full. That's a big deal. I like being practically filled up. I mean... Wording. Phrasing. Lewd. Indeed. I don't need my magic to defeat you anyway. It's not like I have very useful spells. I suppose the healing one is very good, but it's a one-time use. Just like that, I need to heal again. <laughs> uh, poor second character, he would like some extra of this advanced armor himself. When we get to this boss fight, I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna defend with that guy. Okay, I got another one of those items. I didn't even see an enemy show up. Stop doing AOE damage to me. Instead of making my MC super tanky, I should split the difference, but damn it. I was hoping I could camp here safely, waiting for my heels to recover before I go back into the other screen. Close to hitting that level up.
few more battles for it. Let's see if I can sit here for a minute without any enemies disturbing us. I don't know where I'm going. It's dark. I should probably uh, use my last torch for now. Okay. Let's get past these guys. They're so mean. They mostly attack the slightly less armored bro. Status report. We're in a dark spooky cave. There be monsters. Oh, I can see. Isn't that nice? Yeah, I feel like I'm wasting my torch. As I probably have wasted it. Drunk and ready to fight God. Got me some, uh, as a powerful opponent. Make sure you brought the power of friendship and all that good stuff with you. Hey, we leveled up on Homeboy. Just in time before the boss. I think is around the corner here. Kia! Anatata. Uh, Chiwa. Anatata Chiwa. Tanta. Oh, I saw Yosh. Oh shit, I didn't save. Did I save? Saw Kisama, so he said he's gonna kill us. <laughs> Where he said die. Kisama! 
So that's HP count 180 on the bottom. We get to see boss HP. I attack. I have no buffs. So we do get to see HP. I cast fire. Alright, 7 damage. Nice. I took 24. MC took 1. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to heal our guy. And then he's going to just hit the defend button the whole time. And MC's going to swing his sword. That last swing. Rando. Defend. That's the game plan. I have no idea what that was. Uh, well, all right, I'm going to need to swing <laughs> as well. Okay, I guess we're dazing him, and we want to daze him. If we don't do enough damage, then he's gonna do a big attack. Yeah, so when he's angry like this, it's not good. He heals? Bruh. 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 We're gonna have to get lucky. Uh, we have to crit in order to activate that stun, it seems. So, my main character has to crit. I mean, the second guy can do it too, but he's less likely to do it. Oh my god, this damage is increasing. Nice crit. If we could just do that like two more times. Nice. Looks like it doesn't chain there. It only stuns him after he's fixed himself. Okay, it's good he hit him, let's see. MC failed the crit there. Alright, why the dude's dead? That's fine. Yeah, he just took 200 damage, I think. Alright, we made it. I wonder if because I healed, he healed. Or maybe he's just set the heal at that, at that point. First boss down.
don't have a lot of information to convey to each other. Party. <clears throat> Alright, now we've got Flora. Let's see what kind of magic she has. She has some combat ability and also the healing spell. So we have three heal spells. And let's check her gear. So she's 11 and 5, 110 magic. Oh, she's unequipped. Well, have a sword. And some armor. Some other stuff. Wait, is this better? No. No, it's not. <laughs> I don't have a charm for you. Yeah, let's save. We need to get out of the cave, which... I assume I can just warp out of here. Let me make sure there's nothing else down here. It's just a little torch. Stairs. What the heck is this? Is this a dragon? I don't know. It moved a little bit. The downstairs. We don't want to go downstairs. We want to go up. Okay, there's nothing else here. I'm pretty sure we can just leave, so I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna go back to Yold. And why manually walk out when I can wapu? So we have to come back up here and uh, talk to Sonia. There's the girl in the green hair. Not sure if Sonia and Flora are related or not. Because they both have green hair. Eh? Oh, so. Hmm. In.
seeing a lot of deaths here, which is talking about or imp implying yourself, right? And there was a lot of uh, questions being asked. There's a lot of ka, desika, or masika. Okay. Anyway, once we talk to her, I believe we're good to move on, but I am getting tired. It's going on 12 o'clock for me. So I think we're gonna park it here. But before I park it, I want to get my guy to level 7. And then uh, we'll, we'll keep pushing forward after he's level 7. And if I'm lucky and I get the knights, which this is not the knights, damn it. I was hoping to get another weapon for 150 bucks to sell. We got three characters. Oh, yeah, I want to see what her spell is. Let's do. Uh, this is her. Oh. Some kind of buff? Some kind of buff. She can cast it multiple times? Maybe it's like a cure of some status. Could be a cure of status. You Nintendo didn't get that correct. Oh, I forgot how bad the EXP is. Oh, oh now it's it's divided by three characters. That's why. Ah, old RPGs in the modern day, you get 100% XP on everybody, but back in the day, they divide that shit. In between everybody. Oh, it's the worst. Kind of monsters make you get less XP per character. Got a third member. We have a third member. We beat the first boss. He missed it. He killed one of my guys. He did like 200 damage to the one guy. Pretty fucked up. So I can't find any knights since I want them. Oh, there they are. Oh, hells yes. Drop your weapon. Do it. Drop it for me, baby. Drop it. Be bad at these quizzes. No, they're tough questions. You you either know because you played the game and love it to death. Tough to figure out. How long have they been on my channel? A little while now. I've had these for 
few months. Probably almost a year. I always wanted something fun to do with channel points that doesn't involve me paying attention to it. Something automatic for you guys to entertain yourselves with. And I had the quiz bot made courtesy of Chiral. He programmed the quiz bot for me and I input the questions myself. And thus... We have a quiz bot. Alright everybody, we're gonna save here and park it. Cause I'm tired. We got everybody to seven. We cleared the first boss. Uh, if I is the preview through this uh, thing. The guide. There it is. This is the last chapter. There's five chapters in the game. So structurally, it's not too long, but we can tell the length of the game is coming from the grind. So we'll find out next time when we go to the next area if it sort of resets in difficulty again, or if we can make some headway because we're finally geared up to a decent degree. At least MC is. And we have three characters now, which is a big difference. But anyway, hope you all have a good one. Take care, and I'll see you later.